yo, yo. Welcome <laughs> to the Red Cup Boys uh, podcast, uh, episode number, episode number, what is it, like 15? I have no idea, <laughs> <laughs> episode number 15, episode number 15, I hope, if not, fuck it, it's 15 now, yep. I'll make next week's 14, yes, if it's not, I'm pretty sure, I think we're at 14, mm-hmm. Is wow, we're at four, no, no, 15. 15? We have 15 already? I think so. God damn. Let's hear it for 15 episodes of the Red Cup Boys on the Elite Player Network. Yes, yes, yes. Number 15. Ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen. You could have been anywhere in the world, Yo. but you're here with us today. Yes, sir. It's your boy FaZe. <laughs> Bait Do is in the building. Uh-huh. Let's go. Uh-huh. Make sure you like and subscribe. Leave a comment or two. Fill up those red cups. Fill them up all the way to the top. We're potting today. Oh, we're potting. Yes. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh. Yeah. Yeah. It's the Red Cup. Red Cup. Red Cup is in the building. Ah, man, it Red feels Cup. so good to be here, man. It feels so good. So fucking incredible. Oh, shit, man. We missed him a week. Yeah. It's been busy. Yeah. A lot of shit has happened. We've been doing shit, bro. We've yeah. We've been doing shit. We've been doing shit. How's your, how's your week been? It's been good. Yeah? Yeah. What'd you get up to? Uh, wow. Like, like you said, we've been busy. <laughs> a lot of projects. So last week was Buddy Stag, mm-hmm. right? So we're not going to get into details because you know what it is. Yeah. What happens when you're out of town stays out of town. Yeah. But uh, yeah, it was a great weekend. A few of the boys just chilled out, had a good time, had a few beverages. It's nice. I uh, felt it the entire week, which is <laughs> part of the reason maybe we weren't here last week. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, shit. All right, we'll put this down because <laughs> it's just clutching this shit. I was gonna make a joke about holding it, and then I had nothing. So yeah, like, nothing is <laughs> over. Bit, bit. Yeah, man, player, just man. yeah, man, just I'm getting prepared for the fucking post lockdown shit. Okay. Again. Okay. Because the first time I did it, I was super excited, and then they shut the shit down again. Oh, they shut that shit down quick, bro. Yeah, and I'm hoping we're almost there. You know, end of the month, they might make an announcement. They might, you know, open right. it up a little bit more. Right. So, you know, we have a few deals with the nightclubs. Okay. Get a few nights going. Okay, okay. We got the comedy thing going. Vancouver, we got comedy night starting. Hey. Because Yuck Yucks closed down. No more Yuck Yucks. Yeah. So now there's been like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're bringing the Yuck Yucks back. Yeah. Shout it's, out to the yuck yucks. Yuck 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 yuck. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly the name. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. They're not suing nothing. But it's over. <laughs> Four yucks. Yeah, man. And just a little pivot from the regular music club yeah. nights, the regular shit that we're known for. Um, yeah, just create another avenue for the company for Elite Player Entertainment. Uh, yeah, so Comedy Lizard and Elite Player Entertainment are teaming up, and we're gonna provide weekly comedy nights Ooh. bring in local talent bring in out of town talent whoever wants to come perform come perform yeah. come out have some drinks have some laughs it's a safe safe mm-hmm. comfortable place to just spend an evening okay. 
Yeah, it's you dope. never know, man. I might, I might pull up, get on yeah, stage. Yeah, hundred percent. Butt ass, you probably should. Butt ass naked and some tins. <laughs> okay, you, don't gotta, I mean, you don't gotta do all that, but <laughs> yeah, you can get there. Here's a stage, ladies shirt. and gentlemen. Tell some jokes. <laughs> come to the bo- come to the stage. Like, Sexual chocolate. <laughs> Here I am. Here I am. Here I am. <laughs> Give me come, a hug. <laughs> come, come. Here I am. Just butt ass. Here I am. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a hug. I'm here, guys. <laughs> pull up this is what you paid for. <laughs> Where my hug at? Where my hug at? Come on, girl. Don't do me like that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, girl. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, man. So we got that going weekly, and then once a month we're gonna have one big event, yeah. big comedy night. Okay, okay. And we're actually gonna film those for the Elite Player Network oh, as saying. well. So yeah, we got that going on, and then you know we have you know some club nights in the works as well. We'll okay. get more into detail once things open up. Yeah. We'll we'll uh, hopefully they open up, and then we'll uh, announce those and okay. lock it down. But yeah, we. Been working, man. Yeah. Dropped a music video today. Oh. Yeah, new track, new okay, video. Okay, okay. Yeah, just... <laughs> Yo, okay. Y'all definitely need to go on the Elite Players um, channel yeah. and check out that video because that shit is sick. It was done by uh, Forbes. Forbes, And yeah. that nigga just killed that shit. So yeah. make sure, sure y'all go check that shit out. Yeah, uh, man, subscribe, check it out. like. Push that shit. Let the algorithms algorithm. And, uh, you know? <laughs> let the algorithm Let that shit blow up, bro. Let yeah. that shit blow up. Yeah, yeah, for sure, man. It feels good to have something out. Yeah. You know, get the ball rolling. Yeah, we got a lot of music, a lot of videos coming. So yeah. nice to just kick it off mm-hmm, with this. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah, we're going to keep it moving. So we're pushing that right now. Make sure you guys go check it out. Subscribe to the network. We got a lot more music coming. I'm not just, like, my stuff. A lot of his stuff. Uh, yeah, you actually just shot a video and you're gonna be shooting another one shooting another one that's great and you got a few other big collabs yep. I mean you've had a few collabs recently and you have a lot more coming yeah got some collabs with some some, some guys in the states some yeah. guys out of LA um, got a collab with some girls from Jamaica there I you can't go. like yo there it's some go. serious it's coming it's, it's some coming. serious shit bro. that's why they got subscribed so yeah, they get the little notifications when the shit drops yeah, right I don't wanna tell you who they are but you know big shit, shit. it's big shit, shit yeah. for sure yeah, so we got a lot, we got a lot of stuff coming on the network. Okay. So make sure you guys uh, check it out, subscribe, all that shit. Yeah, so just been busy with a lot of the EP stuff, yeah. pretty much. Okay. Yeah. That's what's just up. Been busy, yeah. That's what's up, bro. Yeah. How about you, man? What have you been up to? Bro, I've been like grinding, bro. Just work- yeah. you know how it is, bro. I'm out here 100%. just working. Yeah. If I'm not working, I'm trying to catch up on sleep. <laughs> if I'm not doing that, I'm yeah. either hitting the gym or like you know home studio, bro. So I'm there like recording go. shit, yeah. putting laying laying shit down and shit. But you know, just building this empire one one track at a time. That's what's up. One track yeah. at a time, bro. Trying For to do sure, this man. shit. But besides that, bro, my week's my week's been I. Right. Your week sounds pretty good. <laughs> But the week that's been going on in the media, bro, this shit's been crazy. Oh, man. So, <laughs> Yo. First of all. There's a lot of shit. You miss one week of podcasting. We miss one God week damn. And everything goes to shit. God damn. <laughs> what is happening in the world? So, it starts off with Lil Fizz. And okay. if, if you guys aren't familiar with who Lil Fizz is. Bum, bum, bum. Lil Fizz. Exactly. <laughs> Lil Fizz is a member of B2K. So, B2K composes of Lil Fizz, Omarion, and two other niggas that I really don't <laughs> give a fuck about. But, um... <laughs> to be honest, when he said, all I knew was Omarion, yeah, yeah, I was like, right? who the fuck is Lil Fizz? <laughs> Omarion and company. <laughs> like, when, he's, when he first told me, I didn't give a shit. I was like, why does this matter? I was like, who's Lil Fizz? He was like, he was in B2K. I was like, oh, yeah. now it matters. Okay. So, That's a little bit different. <laughs> that hits a little bit different. Yo, it's crazy. So, right yeah. now, right now, B2K is on a Millennium Tour with... Chris Brown, um... B2K is touring still? Tw- bro. Hey, man, if Backstreet Boys yo, are touring, then B2K can getting, tour, man. But who am I to complain? Hate, bro. Get they're, your they're money, man. Bread, Get your bro. money. Like, straight up. Get your money, So they're man. on tour oh. right now. Chris Brown, oh. B2K, um, oh. I think, like, a bunch of other male R&B acts, shit like that. Damn. Um, so it's, it's, it's lit right now. That's I a think, pretty sick tour. Yeah, it's pretty, it's yeah. pretty sick. Um, fuck, so... Uh, Lil Fizz goes on stage. Mm-hmm. While Marion singing, and I guess they had to, they they performed together. So everyone was like, "Oh shit!" Like it was a big moment because the backstory is, Marion's baby mama, okay, April. Mm. She's fine as hell. But <laughs> <laughs> you just had a moment there. Yeah, I did. Just a little by itself. <laughs> kind she of is so fine. Uh-huh. She is so fine. Uh-huh. But do you need to apologize to Marion? No, 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 no. Not yet. <laughs> I don't even want to ask my mom. He knows his baby mom fine. <laughs> but, bro, like, 
like so his little fizz. So, <laughs> God damn. Ah, so yo, so anyways, little fizz. Uh, oh wait, well, what the fuck am I trying to say? Okay, so April. Yeah. And Omarion. Uh huh. They had a baby together, had a great relationship, and then that shit fell apart. So it wasn't so great. Now. With her being separated and Omarion, you know, doing his thing too. Lil Fizz, being Omarion's homie and groupmate, went and started to have a relationship with April. This whole shit played out on Love and Hip Hop. <laughs> All right. What? <laughs> bro. This is on TV. On TV, <laughs> bro. bro. This just gets on better and better. On fucking better. Love and Hip Hop, bro. <laughs> So, Listen, I'm just waiting for Tory Lanez to show up in this story. <laughs> that's, all, that's all I'm waiting for. I know he's in here somewhere. I know he's in here somewhere. I'm just waiting. So this whole shit plays out on Love and Hip Hop. April and Fizz are doing their shit. And eventually, I guess, the allure of, you know, that whole secret relationship. It went public, mm-hmm. obviously, because it's on TV. Yeah. And I guess April lost the allure of it. So then April then breaks up with Lil Fizz. Okay. Right? April breaks up with Lil Fizz, moves on. She starts dating some like some drug dealer slash rapper. Is this part all in the show still? No, that part this isn't is in, the show, in the show. Yeah, okay. that part isn't in the show. This <laughs> drug dealer's on TV now. Camera in his face, like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, if you need any products, <laughs> come to this address. <laughs> <laughs> Worst drug dealer. I know. <laughs> get arrested in three minutes. As soon as, soon as it hits the air, <laughs> cops at the door. Oh my god. Oh, they find me. Bitch, you're on love and hip hop. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo, if I'm a drug dealer, I'm never going on a show called Love and Hip Hop. Yeah, people watch bro, that. Bro, fuck yes. that, bro. Yeah, right? You can't do that shit. How are you moving out here? Come on. Oh, man. Shit. Okay, so, so she started dating this drug dealer. She started dating this drug dealer. If you have Amazon Prime, you can find these episodes on Amazon Prime. Okay. Yeah, but, um, so pretty much... Did Amazon the... Prime pay us for that shit? No, they don't. But Amazon, come on, send us It's not on Amazon Prime. <laughs> it's, it's, it's on Prime Amazon. Uh, yeah. <laughs> How about yeah. that? <laughs> But, uh, fuck. Yeah, but... So, pretty much, that whole shit happened. Mm-hmm. Um, Omari, I know, got a baby mama. Lil Fizz ain't got no girl. Drug dealer running around with this girl, and eventually they break up. Fizz, I guess a couple years later, which is present day now, he, uh, he's on he's on tour with uh, Chris Brown and Omari on Blah, Blah, they perform. And after the performance, Fizz then grabs the mic, and he's like, hold on. I need to say something. Oh my god. I need to say something. So. Because it doesn't sound like time Fizz, to say something. <laughs> Fizz then goes and he apologizes. And he admits that what he did was some snake shit. Uh huh. He's like, I, I love you, you're my brother. I'm sorry for the snake shit that I did to you. I shouldn't have done that. Can you forgive me? Omarion well, daps him up, says, I forgive you. And they continue the rest of the fucking show. Oh my god, <laughs> that's gotta be set up. No, bro, that I can't don't... be the first time you had that conversation with him. Hey, exactly. You're but gonna dude... bring that for the first time. You're gonna bring it up in front of the whole entire stadium and be like, "Listen, man, <laughs> <laughs> what had happened was the funny part. I slipped and fell, and smashed funny... by accident. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, the funny part is, this was okay. This is the what's second. He gonna, what's Omar gonna say? <sighs> Nah, fuck you, and then continue the show. Right? Exactly. <laughs> he, but probably, th- he probably said yes, cool, and then went backstage and punched him in the fucking mouth. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, though, the thing is, though, mm. there was Millennium Tour 1. This is Millennium Tour 2. So Millennium Tour 1 happened a couple years ago. Marion found out about the April and Lil Fizz thing on tour with Lil Fizz and canceled the tour. <clears throat> okay. Right? Omarion was the bigger name, so Omarion got a bigger percentage of the cut. These niggas got pennies. He dipped, said, fuck you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now that they have Millennium Tour 2, Lil Fizz is back, right? Yeah. Lil Fizz is back with this whole shit. So people are saying... <laughs> uh, <laughs> the only reason he did this is because he needed a bag, right? Okay. <laughs> and they're saying that he's obligated to do this at every show. Shut up. I don't think that's true. But that's just you funny to apologize as fuck. Every, every show. show bro. It's like part of the set. Yeah. It's they like got like in the 30. notes. It's in the crib notes. 
30 cities. After track four. <laughs> Apology to Apology, Marion. Yeah. Dab. <laughs> Dab up. <laughs> Drop the track. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? Man. That's was... stupid. What yeah. the fuck? Nah. Yeah, bro. They must have... Okay. If he canceled the tour the first time, there must have been some point where they had a conversation to even organize a second tour. Oh, for sure. Right? So he must have, like, talked to him. He's seen him on the bus. Mm-hmm. Or whatever, right? Like, he had. To, so, what's the first time when he saw him? He's just like, what's up? <laughs> and, just like, and didn't bring it up, didn't say nothing, right? And just saved this whole apology for the fucking show? I don't believe that. I don't believe that either. Nah. But damn, bro. But da- I, hope, I hope he does have to do it for the whole Dad, the he's whole, like, he's like, the whole tour. Pop, if you want this dang, every <laughs> single stop, nigga. They should have named apologize. it. The Lil Fizz Apology, apology Tour. Apology <laughs> Tour, bro. Straight up. Yo. Millennium Tour. Nigga. Nah. Apology Tour. Apologize, bitch. But I'm glad he apologized, though. It, it takes a real man to know, like, you know, you fucked up and you got to do this shit. Because honestly... As much as this nigga wants to go around and be like, oh no, we were in love. Nigga, if we if Omarion did that shit with whoever Fizz Lil Fizz is dating, and trust me, Omarion could have went up to whoever Lil Fizz is dating and been like, yo, like, what's up? And she probably would have went with Omarion. Because he got a bigger name. Mm-hmm. He got money. When the last time you heard a Lil Fizz track? I don't I didn't know who Lil Fizz was, <laughs> exactly. so I asked you. Exactly. <laughs> the fuck? Ain't nobody know no Lil Fizz, bro. Like, <laughs> when you're sitting there thinking of a name to rap under. You're a grown ass man calling yourself yeah. Lil Change like, your name, bro. Who says, like, Lil Fizz? Yeah, that's the one. Lil Fizz. Like, I guess he was Lil before all yeah. the other Lil's showed up. Yeah. Except for, like, Lil Wayne. Damn. Damn. Or, like, Lil Bow Wow. They, I, I feel I like they blew up around one. the same time, though. I guess there was a lot of Lil's. Lil yeah. Flip. Lil There's a lot of old school Lil's. Lil John, yeah, shit, there's a lot. Lil Lil, <laughs> Lil Big, Lil Big, Lil Medium, Lil Small, <laughs> Lil Tall, Lil Tall. <laughs> I'm Lil, but I'm tall. Lil Tall, Lil Small, <laughs> Lil Tall, Yo. Lil Small. You know what? Uh, fuck. What was I gonna say? I was gonna say something. Okay, wait, wait. Yeah. So, how long? So, how long? Omarion and his girl, whatever, they had a kid, right? Yeah. How long was it after they broke up? Little uh, face started going out with her. I'd say probably like. I, I can't. I can't say. <clears throat> like a year, two years, five was, years, ten years. Four for years. comedic, for comedic purposes. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I would say the three next hours. Day. Yeah. <laughs> three hours. Three hours later. He's been waiting. <laughs> <laughs> three hours. <laughs> Yo. But I'm saying you can't do that shit, man. Yo, I know. You can't do it that does, shit. It doesn't, it doesn't matter, matter, bro. It doesn't matter how long. It doesn't, doesn't matter how long. For, yeah, that's what I'm saying. First of all, it doesn't matter how long. Baby mama nigga. Like, yeah. Yeah, you can't do that. He's in your group. He's not even like friends. Like your brothers, man. The thing like, is, bro, the like she, he has two kids with her. You so, look at them kids all the time, you're going to see Omarion. Yo, so think about <laughs> it the whole time when he, while he was with her, a little fizz is just around, like right? liking his wife and shit. <laughs> like, what the? Looking at his wife like that? Like, God damn. damn. Yeah, I'm just waiting for them to break up. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that guy was in your house. He's like, that guy ate at your kitchen table. I know. God damn! He's like, damn, this food's so good. Oh yeah, I'm just you're, looking you're, at you, bro. You're amazing. You're mate. amazing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he like, don't treat you like you should. <laughs> <laughs> Come over here, little fizz. <laughs> you need a little fizz in your life. Little <laughs> fizz. <laughs> oh my god, oh, bro. That's gross. Yeah, bro. That's Get sad, bro. All the girls in the world, you gotta pick your man's girl. Yeah, bro. Like, like, what the come... fuck? Dude, there's so many girls. Go find another one, man. Like, what's wrong with this you? This April look alike. He's like, no, I want that one. <laughs> yeah. I bro. want your girl. But then April, <laughs> too, she's like, she's cute, but her attitude is like, her attitude's so ass. Yo, it's April's fault, too. That's your fucking yeah, ex's, yo, like, I know. bro, like, the I know. fuck? Yo, but you know these girls are petty, though. Like, sometimes, like, it, like when y'all break up, these girls be doing petty-ass <laughs> shit. Yo, that's like... They be fucking when, your homies. Yeah, so when you're with, like... <laughs> yo, this is like... So when you're with your girl and shit, right? And then that, there's that one dude who, like, you know she, you know he likes her? Yeah. Right? You're not boys with him, but you, like, he's around, yeah. like... And they're, like, they're friends. 
Right? It's like you know he likes you, right? She's like, no, he's no, just he doesn't. a friend. He's like, just shut a the friend. Fuck he's up. just a friend, like, but he he loves you. Like he's just waiting for me to get I out know. the way. He's like, no, he he's like my brother, man. Oh, okay. Right, okay. He's then, like and, my and, brother. Listen, 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 call him and ask him if you yeah, want yeah. fuck right now. Exactly, right? <laughs> right but then listen, right. then y'all break up and like three months later they're together. Yeah. Like, Wait, I thought it was your brother. brother. You think your brother that's how you that's how you're moving now? That's how you're moving. You fuck your brothers now, bitch. Yeah, right. You I brother I, fucker! It's like, I told you! I told you! <laughs> like, you're stupid, uh, man. Ew, like, either shit. that girl's stupid or she's, like, stupid. Because, like, guys know when a guy no, likes No, no, like, no. Like, no, guys fuck? know. And the girls know, too. Dude. Like, everyone yeah. who likes each other, those, they both know. Because, bruh. Mm -hmm. And everyone can see that shit. But girls mm -hmm. be trying to play all oblivious. No, he's just a nice guy. No, fuck nah, that. I nah. know nice niggas. Yeah. And I know niggas who trying to fuck. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. exactly. A it's completely different. Yeah, it's completely, it's completely it's not different. Not even close. <laughs> not even close. <laughs> niggas who trying to fuck. They give yeah. you their jackets and shit. Yeah, there's like <laughs> polite and like flirting. There's it's a big difference. And guys know. Guys oh, know. It's fuck. easy. Playing this fucking day. Yeah, yeah. It's like, yeah, I'd do that if I was trying to smash. Right? <laughs> what the fuck? I'm not trying to hear about your problems and shit. No. <laughs> what the fuck? Call, I know. Call me if you need anything. Call, nah, man. No. Guys don't do that shit. Nigga, like, you got a network of girls you yeah, can call. Exactly. You, know, you want to call yeah. this nigga? Yeah. Call me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, the, the girls I'm friends with, I'm like, you all right? All right, cool. <laughs> that's, 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 that's as much as I need to know. Shit. I'm not trying to be like, uh, yo, let's sit down and talk for eight hours on the phone all night. Like, right? Get the fuck out of here. But yo, though. even though Little Fizz apologized, though, how, as a Mario, you can't trust this nigga, though. No, fuck no. You can't trust him no, around no, the girl no. no more. You know you fucked that shit up, bro. No, nah, like, nah, we're going to do the tour and get the bag. Bag, but... I, I don't want to see you till Millennium 3. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. It's over. <laughs> That's all we're doing now. We are business partners nigga, now. Yo. <laughs> You're lucky I brought you on this tour. Yeah, bro. I could have been the Mario on the Chris Brown tour. <laughs> oh, Mario's been... like, I heard you were broke. Yeah, Let right. me help you out a little yeah. bit. <laughs> this guy's giving 5%. This isn't even allowed on the whole tour. Probably like no. two days. He's on a different bus. <laughs> he get two days. Here's $500, nigga. He's changing in the fucking broom closet. Ew. <laughs> uh, oh, man. He's fall in the mop and shit. This guy's in the Uber behind the bus. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, man. Is Uber getting pulled by the bus? <laughs> it's like dead. It's on two wheels. Yeah. My battery died <laughs> like a month ago. <laughs> Tires flat. All oh, that shit. Oh fuck, oh, bro. Shit. Damn, bro. No physics. Like you can't. Like you, how do you? How? How? You can't even mend that relationship properly. Like nah. No, you can't. You got to apologize, though. That's his fucking bread and butter right Bitches there. Bitches ain't shit. Niggas ain't He's shit. He's not making money without right. a Marion. Yeah. So you got to... Yeah. Unless, that's, he, that's does, probably unless why. he does Love and Hip Hop by himself. That's like the only no, bed... Man. You can show me a picture of Lil Fizz and I won't even know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> like, who the fuck is this guy? I know. Like, I don't know. I know Marion. I don't know anybody else. Yeah. So it's like... There's man. two other guys in that group. Holy fuck. There, there's, yeah. <laughs> there's four people in, in BTK, Yo, bro. That's crazy. Man, they There's did. four people yeah, in B2K. Lil did Omarion. Dirt, I don't know, a goddamn bro. one. That's like with Omarion. Shit. Was Lil Bow Wow on that tour? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lil Bow Wow I was going to say, yeah, cause, like, isn't Omarion like his boy or yeah, like yeah. signed him or some shit yeah, right now? Bow, That's, Bow they're everywhere that together. That's yeah. the other thing I was forgetting. Yeah. Bow was on that tour, so it's crazy. Yeah. Him and Chris Brown finally That's, probably, that's a cool tracks. tour. That's a cool yeah, tour. Bro, yeah, bro. That shit's probably lit as fuck. I've always liked fucking Lil Bow Wow. Yeah. He doesn't like fucked up shit in the media, but music wise, I fuck he's, with him. Yeah, he's music good. wise, he's, yeah, he's, he's a good performer, yeah. shit, good music. Fuck, bro. Yeah. So, yeah, man, that's the whole shit on that, man. These niggas out here doing some weird shit, bro. I swear to God, bro. It, like, LA, LA's different, my nigga. Like, yeah. <laughs> That's, LA is that's just being nice. different. That's a bro. nice like, word to describe yeah. LA. And speaking of different, so you got this fuck nigga R. Kelly. <laughs> Yo, that's transitioning. Yeah, thank you. You're, bro. you're, you're, you're transitioning, bro. <laughs> you're stepping it up. Swoop, stepping swoop. it up. Stepping I'm switching legs on these bitches, bro. <laughs> stepping I put it my up. transition game in sport mode, bro. <laughs> I had to. <laughs> I had to, bro. <laughs> Damn. Oh, shit. So R. Kelly. Oh man, can King we can, can we say his name? Do we gotta bleep it out? <laughs> the Pied Piper himself. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Mr. Twelve Play. Right? 
if you see a trail of candies leading to a forest, yeah. don't go. That's R. Kelly's house. Jesus. Like, <laughs> this motherfucker out here doing some weird shit. <laughs> but apparently, he got he got a racketeering charge. So usually, I thought racketeering was for, like, for like drugs and shit. Mm-hmm. But I guess that's associated with sex trafficking and shit, too. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So, he got a racketeering charge. Apparently, he was... Like, the shit he was doing to these girls, bro. Yo. Some fucked up shit. They're saying he could get between, like... Gross. They're saying he could get between, um... I think they're saying, like, 40 years was the minimum, and 120 years was the max. <laughs> What's the point of 120 years? Right? It's like, nigga... <laughs> this guy's got, like, 50 years. <laughs> max. 30. <laughs> max. If he's not... The 30, That's if he, like, if, fucking goes gluten-free, right? does fucking yoga, <laughs> all that shit. <laughs> keto diet all that shit he's like yeah I'm intermittent fasting now yeah everything everything <laughs> like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh man yo yeah, but yeah crazy. bro like apparently he was like doing some weird shit to these girls like he was like tying them up not feeding them and like people would come to the studio he was doing this shit in his studio artists would come to his studio and act like like, you know, like, he, he'd probably, like, tell these girls beforehand, like, y'all better not say shit, y'all better not do nothing, yeah. whatever, act normal, and the girls would obviously <laughs> obey this dude, and nothing would happen. These artists didn't click in, didn't clue in, but my thing isn't even with the artists. It's with the people that were around this motherfucker every single day. Yeah, for sure. That shit's so fucked, man. That's crazy. Right? I can't believe that kind of shit can, like, I don't know, man. <laughs> He's man. fucked. It's, he's so fucked, bro. I was watching Surviving R. Kelly. They were saying, like, oh, like, when he was young, he had, um, like, rape, like, he got, like, raped, apparently, or, like, That's usually what it is with, like, people who do this shit now. Usually had some shit happen to them when they were younger and shit, and it kind of, like, fucks them up and, like... Yeah, but, bro, But like, they, like, continue the fucking, like, process of that shit. Like, if you went through the shit, why would you do the shit? Yeah, but, but it's I, obviously they're not fucking, you know... I'm gonna right. be very vulnerable on this podcast right now. Uh-huh. Same sort of shit has happened to me when I was, when I was little... Oh, for real? For real. But you don't see me out here tying bitches up and shit like that, my nigga. Like, you know what I mean? I ain't starving bitches. It not, <laughs> it's miles. It better not be in here. You don't see me peeing on people. <laughs> Talking about drip, drip, drip. Like, you don't see me doing that shit, bro. Fuck that. Like, you gotta be fucked up. Like, I don't give a fuck, man. Drip, like, drip, drip. <laughs> You gotta be fucked oh up, God. bro. You gotta be on some fucked up shit in, like, in order for, like, you know? Yeah. Like, come on, bro. Like, that That's shit is... crazy. Ah, uh, man. Like, you grown-ass man talking to all these little girls and, like, people from his camp would go drive up to high schools and be like, oh, you want to meet R. Kelly? Like, it's on some creep shit. You want to meet R. <laughs> Kelly? Like, yo, and they're like, yeah. At that time, they're like, yeah. Yeah, of course. He's, like, one of the biggest fucking stars, man. Right? Yeah. <laughs> But now I can't even, like, listen to his music the same, because it's, like, he's talking to, like, fucking 13-year-olds and shit. Right. Or, or even, like, less. Like, nah, it's gross. Or Kelly pulling up the girls, he's like, do you believe you can fly? Let me show you. <laughs> like, I want some weird shit, nigga. Nah. He's, he's deleted. His whole <laughs> playlist said, nah. is deleted. Oh, my God, it's done. bro. It's over. Yeah, man. R. Um, Kelly's a... That, that a nigga's rap. cut. That yeah. nigga is cut. People are having debates. They're like, oh, like... Like, can we still listen to music that other he's wrote for other artists that artists have performed? And I'm like, yo, like, how many... Are, the thing is, realistically, <clears throat> how many people are going to search the credits? Yeah, nobody. Yeah. It's whatever. Yeah, that came up, right? Oh, yeah, but I think we talked about it. He had, like, a credit in somebody's song. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, but he probably has credits on, like, mad songs. Mad songs. This guy's songs. a good writer. Like, fuck. He's like, been writing for years. Yeah. For lots of artists. You're not gonna lots listen to... Lots of artists. You're not gonna listen to Aaliyah anymore? You're not, no, you're not gonna listen to Chris Brown? Yeah. You're not gonna listen to Drake? Yeah. You're not gonna listen to a lot of these R&B artists that, are, that you listen to? Yeah. Like... Yeah, for sure. Not only wrote for a lot of these guys, but, like, definitely 100% influenced them. Mm-hmm. Music-wise, for sure. So, like... Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, it's it's sad. It's fucked up that he did this because this guy is one of the biggest stars and he has good music. But like, just everything he did in his personal shit, like I can't fuck with it anymore. Doesn't yeah. matter. I can get by. There's a lot of R and B out there. Yeah, there's it's a lot fine. of R and B. We'll be fine. I don't need to step in the name of love. <laughs> nah, nah. When that nigga gonna get his ass tossed in jail, I can tell you that. Oh. I can oh, tell you that. Oh, this nigga's not gonna survive. This guy. I don't <laughs> know where they're gonna put him. <laughs> in the ass tossing section. need to section. put him under the jail. <laughs> 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 oh shit! Yeah, he's fucked. Damn, bro. 
Yeah, literally. But you know, these celebrities always figure out a way to like avoid the shit. You know? Mm, nah, I, 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 know. I okay. I feel even like, like even if we don't know about it, like yeah, they say he's gonna go to jail, but he might be in like some fucking Hollywood fucking jail where you get like eight meals a day and like movie time and like fucking just working out Twitch. and shit. Yeah, he's got like a full ass like king size bed and like who knows, man? He just might be like it might be like a house arrest type shit. But, like who knows? I hope not. I, I hope but not. Like, it better not be, Who man. the fuck knows? It better not fucking be, bro. That shit's ass. <sighs> yeah. That shit is ass. But yeah, man. Fuck you'll, R. Kelly. And then good, you'll get out of good behavior and then oh, yeah. start the fucking comeback to her. <laughs> you know? And fucking make money again. <sighs> you know what pisses me off, though? Even through all this shit, those people outside the jail. With like outside the courthouse, sorry, with fucking posters and shit like that, screaming out "Free R. Kelly," bumping his music. They had a fucking block party for the dude. That's like, the dumbest shit. Dumb ass shit. What are you doing? And it's like, wait until it's one of your kids. Wait until it's yeah. your niece. Yeah. Wait until it's like you know someone you fucking know. Yeah. People don't give a fuck till it happens to them. And, and, then, like, and ah. then it's like, oh, now we now you want everyone yeah. to care. Like yeah. you didn't give a shit when no. it wasn't happening exactly. to you, right? Exactly. That yeah. shit's some fucked up shit. Yeah. Some fucked up shit, bro. Anyways, yeah, fuck R. Kelly. Mm-hmm. I'm going to make some fuck R. Kelly merch. If anyone feels like buying, let me know. <laughs> oh, there you go. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, shit. And none of the proceeds is going to R. Kelly. Trust me. <laughs> no, it's going to us. Yeah. We got a podcast. Oh, yeah, we're going to tell you straight up. It's going to us, man. It's going to it's us. It's going to us. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> In these pockets. <laughs> in that pocket? In yeah, this pocket. Exactly. Straight up. Straight up. <laughs> support us and we'll support you. you 100%. Know what I mean? 100%. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Shit. We flying, bro. We flying. And like, yeah. So, <laughs> transitioning. Speaking of flying, bow. <laughs> Another three. <laughs> Game, bro. I feel like you only said we fly, so you can go to that. I'm like, why is it saying we fly? Yeah, why are you calling me out? <laughs> where, where did that come why from? Are you me I'm out? like, I, I knew it too. I know, like, I'm like, I bet he said that to transition. Yeah. I gave him too much props the first time, and now, it's, now there's pressure on it. <laughs> now yeah, now he's gotta come through. You don't believe I can fly? <laughs> I mean, I do, but that was a little I, obvious. You don't believe I can fly, man? No, I do. Yo, I do. let me fly, man. No, you fly, man. You fly. Oh. <laughs> I, just, I know you too well. That's the thing. Oh, shit. So, I don't know if you guys heard. It's like, yeah, man. I'm flying. So, speaking of flying. <laughs> so, speaking of flying. It's like, uh, no, we weren't speaking of flying. Let me fly with you. You just briefly mentioned oh. it. <laughs> And then you just continued. You <laughs> see how I brought it back to R. Kelly and then, you know, <laughs> remixed it? Bro, I'm sick with this shit. My transition game. Listen, man. Mm, all sorts of shit. Uh, I'm going to say, you're one for two right now. <laughs> no, my <laughs> transition game is nice. All right, I'm go. Director X with this shit. <laughs> Spike, leave the transition X, game. <laughs> X games mode, bro. X games mode. Oh, shit. All right, speaking of flying. <laughs> speaking of flying. So there was this pilot. And, um, oh, <laughs> those was pilot. So actual flying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I don't know where you're going at. All right, cool. He was flying a plane at an airline for 20 years. All right. Right? Yeah. Never had his license. <laughs> so how'd he get the job? I don't know. <laughs> I don't fucking know. My whole thing is... Man, I can't even get to the restaurant without them checking my ID, bro, my COVID passport. My like, this guy got a job <laughs> flying a plane. <laughs> my life is in his hands and multiple times. I wonder what he was thinking the first day he actually sat in. Yeah, right. He flew He's like, holy He's like, holy shit. fuck, I made it. <laughs> I wasn't planning on going this far. <laughs> and then 20 years later... This yeah. dude's like an expert. Expert. Like, <laughs> yo, so he's been, fly- he's been flying pl- planes for 20 years, getting paid for it and shit. Yeah. <laughs> no, never got into an accident, obviously, because he's still alive. Um, and <laughs> the airline just found out that he hasn't had his license for 20 years. So they fired him. And the public is outraged because they're like, yo, he's been flying for 20 years already? Yeah. Just give him his fucking license. Like, <laughs> yeah, right? Like, he's good. I clearly. think he's proved he's like, he can fly. So listen, he got the job without them checking ID mm-hmm. experience or anything. Nothing. Now he has 20 years of experience. And they're like, nah, you can't do this no more. <laughs> the fuck kind of backward shit is this? I know. <laughs> 
Listen, fuck school, man. You can learn on the job. Exactly. Clearly. If this guy can fly a plane, you know, someone can make some fucking sandwiches or fucking, you know, put some boxes away or exactly. some shit. You don't need, but, like, eight years of experience to work in a warehouse exactly. and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Like, I've, been, I've been picking up shit my whole life. What do you mean? <laughs> it's like, no, but you didn't pick it up like this. Yeah, you gotta use your back. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta use your back. <laughs> Oh, shit. Like, but look, I, I get why they fired him though because obviously the legal ramifications that come with it if they got into an accident and people died on that shit and they found out that this motherfucker wasn't licensed bro okay, that but airline like, would not exist anymore okay well, but just give him his license now he clearly knows how to fly a plane so give him his license and now he can fly legally but the airlines aren't the people that give him the license you know he actually gotta go to school for that shit He's been going to school for 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> On the job experience. Uh, What's yes, better than that? But technically. It's like, nah, man. You, it's like, nah, man. No. Get out of the plane you've been flying for 20 years. Go back in the classroom yeah, and write this class. Get the fuck out of here. It's like, yo. Yeah. I some got people, real life experience. That's crazy, yep, man. Yep, yep. Some people just test badly. You know? They know how to do this shit, but they can't, like, word it or answer the questions. Yeah. But if you put them in the fucking cockpit... <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing because I said cockpit. <laughs> <laughs> That's not why I'm laughing. Yeah, it I'm is. Hundred percent. <laughs> if it wasn't before, now it is. <laughs> this dude's the Consuela of fucking <laughs> violence, bro. <laughs> like, yo, man. <laughs> Do you have license? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay. No, okay. Okay. <laughs> Can you leave the cockpit? No. Like, yo, this nigga's like... This, nigga's this guy, bro. the first day's in the cockpit on YouTube, like, how to fly plane. <laughs> how to fly plane. <laughs> 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 yeah. This nigga's using YouTube tutorials. Fuck uh, out of here, bro. Hello, this is your pilot. Uh, hold on. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> we about to start. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. <laughs> See you there, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. It's like, everyone start calling your loved ones now. <laughs> yeah, right? Just in case. <laughs> Did your pilot speaking? Yeah, and have a good flight. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy, Yeah, man. bro. Holy fuck. Oh, man. No, man, that's nuts. That's the ultimate finesse. <laughs> the ultimate. So thing. now, what's his deal? Is he like trying to get his license? Down? I think he's just chilling now. Flying for a different airlines. He's he's, a, he's an old motherfucker now, bro. So he's probably oh, just chilling. Bro, right. okay. <laughs> I think he knew what he was doing, so hopefully he stacked some money away or something. Uh, yeah. Because twenty years, bro. That's a long ass that's a time, long man. Ass fucking time. He's just like any day now. They're gonna find out. Three sixty five times twenty, bro. Like, come on, man. Like this guy flew a hundred times a year. Right. He's like, yo, any day can be my last flight. <laughs> yeah. He's like, yo, let me just give him my all. Twenty years later, they just decided to check. Like, what tipped them off? This dude was like, never. Late Why randomly? Day? Yeah, right. He's like the perfect employee. He's like, if I fuck up once, they're gonna look at my yeah, fucking record right? and shit. <laughs> if I'm like, late one time They're gonna look at my file But there is no file <laughs> Shit <laughs> Just empty file folder <laughs> What the fuck Oh my god That's crazy man What the f- <laughs> Man like, They're like Do you have a license? He's like You need one? <laughs> you need Fuck's one that? <laughs> license He's like, I, have a, I have a driver's license but <laughs> yeah. I just walk straight on the plane Don't stop me So here we are 20 years later Shit <laughs> bro It's easy That is some ballsy shit But Fuck, man. I applaud that, man. Give that dude his license and let him fucking fly, man. He's been killing yeah, that shit. Yeah, fuck it. Might as well at this point. Oh, man. Yeah. But yeah, bro. That was in... That shit... I think the dude's from, like, Florida or Miami. I don't know what's up with these Florida people, man. That's some crazy shit, bro. Like, seriously. <laughs> everyone like, in Florida is I fucking... Feel like, I feel a transition coming up. <laughs> <laughs> the next story is about Florida. <laughs> Bro, leave me alone, man. I'm going to fight. But I'm just saying. Meek Mill Mill was in Florida. (laughs) And his album just dropped. (laughs) Like, what does that have to do with anything? Oh, shit. Nah, nah. But he, I think he's from Florida, bro. But like, it's, it's, some Florida niggas crazy, bro. Mm -hmm. It's crazy as fuck. It's some weird ass shit. Yeah, Florida's nuts, man. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of crazy shit in Florida. They don't give a fuck over there. Oh man, yeah, bro. It was it. It's been crazy in Florida. Actually, there's been like a couple of rappers mm-hmm. that have been passing that have been getting shot. One rapper from uh, Kodak Black's camp. Yeah. He got shot up, and he actually well he passed away, 
And then there's uh, another rapper, Spot Em, Got Em. The guy who came out with the beatbox track. Yeah. Uh, that went viral on like TikTok and shit. Oh, fuck. He got shot five times. Oh, shit. That's like, a, I think it was like a day or two after Kodak's dude got shot up. Holy shit. Shot five times critical condition, but thank God he made it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, fuck. Shout out to, shout out to Spot Em, Got Em. Yeah, they spotted fuck. him and they got him. But he got up Clearly, he got <laughs> and up. got the fuck out. <laughs> so right, yeah, it. man, okay. that's it's, it's some crazy shit going out, uh, going down that there in Florida, nuts. man. I don't know why it's always oh, nuts like that. You got XXX and Tyson got shot up in Florida, bro. Like, well, oh, he's from shit. there, like yeah. you know, like just nuts, 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 shit. That's Florida's going on, a hot man. spot. Yeah, bro. Damn. <laughs> Tory Lanez lives in Florida. <laughs> I, I had to add Tori just for you. <laughs> no, I know, right? I'm just waiting. He's gonna come just up at some you. point. Some wild shit. Oh, man. What did this guy tweet? Have you checked his Twitter recently since we started? He's probably done some shit. Oh my god, I haven't checked. I haven't checked. <laughs> but yeah, bro. And then there was even these um these two girls. They were doing some crazy shit. So was this in Florida? Yeah, it's in Florida <laughs> too, bro. That's what I'm saying, bro. I'm like. <laughs> nice yeah, 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 yeah. I saw it coming. <laughs> Call my shit. Call my shit. <laughs> but yeah, bro, these two girls in Florida. Speaking of Florida. <laughs> these two girls in Florida. They're out here. They finessed this dude. I guess this dude was having a good, great time in the club. Saw these two thick, thickita Spanish mommies. Oh, shit. And he was like, oh, do you know what? You want to be nice? My ball's in between both these bitches. <laughs> And he got a little bit more than what he bargained for. <laughs> you know what mm-hmm. I mean? So, <laughs> this guy went up, got a oh. hotel room. Shorties came up. He was feeling nice. Thought he was going to have a nice fiesta. Muy, muy caliente. <laughs> muy caliente. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Uh, and then... Uh, Imagine how he was feeling. <laughs> Just walking back to the crib with these two shirts. Right? This nigga popped yeah. the sex pill before his dinner. Oh, yeah. He's ready to go. He's not taking any chances. <laughs> He's like, I took... Like, I nah. took two rhinos. Yeah. I'm good to go. Yeah, <laughs> like, fuck, he's like warming up, doing stretches and shit in the bathroom, did some push-ups. Took an Advil so he doesn't have the headache after. Like, yeah. you know, all that shit. Yeah. <laughs> he's ready to go. He was prepared. Prepared, ready to go. He did leg night day. of his life. Right? This nigga did leg days so his testosterone <laughs> is even. <laughs> his libido's better, you know? All that shit, bro. <laughs> he was ready. And he gets up there, pours some drinks, these ladies... Pour some drinks for this nigga, not knowing. They laced it with some shit. Homie passes out. <laughs> Homie passes out. <laughs> and they rob this nigga. <laughs> and they take his Rolex. The Rolex is worth 10K. And if people don't know, you steal anything over $5,000, it becomes grand theft. Yep. So, That's why I like to keep it at $4,999. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I'm still here. <laughs> I will steal your Rollins, but I'll steal your VCR. <laughs> right? <laughs> yes. Oh, man. <laughs> his VCR and his bed sheets. <laughs> it's a quick sales, man. Quick sales. Quick, quick, exactly. quick, yeah. <laughs> Out here just... <laughs> Yeah. Carting that shit down the highway. Yeah, right. Bed all sheets for shit. sale. Bed yeah. sheets for sale. <laughs> <laughs> you need a VCR? <laughs> comes with a free VCR. Free VCR. Oh <laughs> Your bed sheet comes with a free VCR. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> left obviously yeah and then he woke up realized it realized what happened called the police police probably laughing their asses off but then <laughs> yo this guy thought he was gonna get some he, he thought he was like, gonna get some right? yeah he got more than what he bargained for <laughs> he got some already yeah, he got some <laughs> oh, shit. they told you not to come to Florida <laughs> Man, <laughs> and the police found the girls. They actually found the girls, which is impressive. Yeah, because police don't ever find shit. <laughs> like they don't ever find. Yeah, anything. right. <laughs> they found them quick. Right? <laughs> God damn. Yo, how come the police never found the niggas that robbed me? Huh? How come they never found those niggas? Huh? Huh? But you gonna find these two Spanish girls in Miami? Yeah. And this dude is not Spanish girls. You gonna find them like? <laughs> Found these two girls, 
And obviously they've been charged and shit. Nigga got his Rolex back, but he's he's butt hurt, so he <laughs> he kept the charges. They found him like pretty quickly. Yeah, right? like yeah. the same day or something. Yeah, shit. same shit. Same they were wearing like the same clothes. Yeah, bro. <laughs> probably <laughs> probably wearing his Rolex too. <laughs> they, they robbed the guy, went straight to the mall, and started spending <laughs> shit. Like, trying to, the fuck? Trying like, to pawn off the Rolex. Yeah, shit. like don't even like give us some time for the shit to cool down or whatever. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah. Change your clothes at least. <laughs> Change something about your appearance and At then all. go shopping? Right? Like, God damn. Damn. So, that's crazy. Crazy, crazy shit, man. Crazy, yeah. crazy shit, but... That's nuts. Yeah, man. That's why you don't be out here just doing shit like that. You find one girl or one nigga that you think is cool, you, and then yeah. y'all too. Don't let nobody be pouring your drinks. If you guys are going out and you're yeah. doing your shit, don't yeah. let no bitches pour your drinks. Pour your own drinks or watch the bartender and let that motherfucker pour the drinks for you because... He's gonna want you to drink. He has incentive for you to keep drinking and for you to actually be awake. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah, like, sure. so. Definitely. Yeah. You gotta keep an eye on that shit, man. Oh, man. You don't. Know, sometimes in the club, like, people hand you drinks all the time. Yeah. But, like, <laughs> if, if someone I don't know hands me a drink, I'm always kind of like, ah. Good. <laughs> Do you know what I'm pressed about? Yeah. I've had more guys come up to me and be like, yo, let me buy you a drink. Yeah. <laughs> than girls. And I'm like, yo, <laughs> why are these niggas trying to buy me a drink, bro? Like, <laughs> Away from me, <laughs> like guys, you know, yeah, these, guys you no know. random ass random guys, guys? like yeah, these niggas trying to fuck me and shit, bro. Like, <laughs> get the fuck away from We're me. We just gonna liquor him up, yeah. Quick. Him up. <laughs> I like my niggas picking. Nah, shit. they probably like nah. They probably know your music and shit, and they're probably like, oh, baby, dude's here. Like, fuck it, get him a drink. Let's get him a drink. Like, yeah, damn, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Nah, I have one random dude, <laughs> bro. I was in the bathroom at fuck yeah. <laughs> So we just go, I was in the bathroom. This is at um, Magnetic, or it used to be Status in New West. That shit just burnt oh, down, shit. actually. Status, damn, yeah. It just burnt down, like, two months ago. But, Yo, um, did that used to be, um, fuck, what was it? Status. It was something else. It's on that hill. Yep. It was something else, because I used to promote there. Really? Yeah. It was something else before Status? Yeah. Damn, all I remember is Status. Yeah. And it was Status for a long ass time. No, it was something else. No, no, I know... Right next to the police station and shit. Yeah, yeah. 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 No, yeah. no. It used to be something it else, It was too. what you think it is. Huh? I don't know. It, said it was what you think it is, but I don't know what the fuck it was It wasn't called. status. It was something else. I'll, I can look it up. Want me to look it up? I'll look it up. Sure. But tell your story. I'll look it up. Sure. So, anyways, I'm in the bathroom, right? Yeah. And I'm chilling. I'm like, yo, I've had a lot to drink. I'm like, you know, you know, you get a lot to drink, you go piss sometimes. So, I went to go pee. This dude's in the bathroom. I'm taking a piss in the urinal, left the left the middle urinal, you know, just to create some space. Yeah. Trying to be too close. I'm rubbing shoulders with the dude while my dick is out. <laughs> you know what, what I mean? <laughs> but then this dude, he's peeing and yeah. he looks over at me. Yeah. And I'm just like, yo, like, what the fuck? So then I look over at him. So then we both lock eyes. We're looking up. Ain't nobody looking down. Like, if this nigga look down, I'm going to beat his ass. <laughs> Don't be looking at my dick. What the fuck? But this dude, yeah, he finishes. Uh-huh. Goes, washes his hands. I wash my hands. He's like, yo, man. He's like, yo, man, like, you look like a real cool dude. <laughs> I was like, no. What the In my fuck? head, I'm like, don't tell me that. Don't tell me. After I just had my dick out. Let bro. me walk out. Let me, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Just doing all this shit. Like, yo, man. Like, all this stuff. He's like, yo, what where you fuck? from? Where are you from? I'm like, I'm from Ghana. Like, you know, West Africa. He's like, oh, cool, cool, cool. I'm from Senegal. I'm from Senegal. I was like, all right, cool. Like, you know? Yeah. And then uh, he's like, yo, man, let me buy you a drink, bro. Let me buy you a drink. Yeah. He's pulling me all close. His the breath. Point? was kicking, bro. Oh, my awesome God. Awesome <laughs> Bruce Lee shit. This nigga's breath was kicking, bro. What the fuck? Like, yo, I was like, what the fuck? And then, like, yeah, so he's like, oh, let me go buy you a drink. He goes to the bar. I, too, I, I pulled an audible. <laughs> and I was like, yo, I'm out. Nigga, I'm out. That's crazy. Yeah, what bro. the fuck? This nigga had two coronas. He was walking around with two coronas. <laughs> He's walking, walking around with it. I'm going to ride you somewhere. Yeah, I know. I was like, yo, leave me really alone. Cool. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like you, man. Yeah, what the oh, fuck? But, yo, it's all some weird shit. That's some crazy. weird shit. Yeah, bro. Oh, shit. But yeah, bro. So watch out. <laughs> That's all I'm trying to say. At the end of the day, watch out. Make sure these niggas ain't buying you drinks. Watch who's putting shit in your drinks. 
And like for sure, man. Yeah, That's especially crazy. especially when you out with these ladies, if you got money and you flashing that shit, and these ladies know that you have money, like if you walking, around, if you're like, oh, you know what, I'm gonna have a good night. I got 10k. I hit the lottery, or I got a settlement. I want to do whatever, or I'm, I made this money. Like I want to do this shit, bro. Watch your fucking ass. Because you ain't the only person that likes money. You know what I mean? Everybody loves money. And some people will do some fucked up shit just to get your money. Yeah. So, yeah, watch out. Yeah, no, 100%, man. This nigga's still looking for status. Yeah, <laughs> was it called? I'm pretty sure it was called something else. I think it was just called status, bro. Really? Yeah. Status. It, it was Club 54 before? I, uh, like a long time ago. Studio 54 or some shit? <laughs> now it's status? status? Why do I think it's a different name? Status? Like, I know status. The, the same owner has yeah. status nightclub in, like, like Cologne or some shit. Oh, okay. But, like, I feel like it was a different name at the time. Because mm. I remember when it burned down, I looked it up, and it said status, and I was like, I think it was a different name. Well, it wasn't called, like, it was called status for a bunch of years, and they switched it to magnetic like, when it burnt down, it was called Magnetic. Magnetic. But, I want to tell you something about Magnetic. Magnetic, that shit was fire. If you want some live, yeah, like, Mexican music, Cuban music, whatever, bro. Yeah. You go there, that was the jam. That's All like, the Latino honey. That's the same club? Bro, yeah, same okay. club. Like, yeah. They'd have live, live, live musicians, like, just out there, just getting it, bro. Just, oh my God, you'd be out there, I was hustling. Moving my hips in ways I didn't know, even know how I could do that shit, bro. What the fuck? I was out there doing my, what's it called, bachata? You're yeah. like, what is happening? Yeah. Man? Why, what is why, happening why, why do I know all the moves? Bro, bro, man, I was killing that <laughs> shit. I was killing that shit, bro. It was nice. It was nice. It was nice, man. If you, if that shit, if they ever rebuild that shit, and that shit's popping again, I highly recommend go to New West and check that shit out. That shit's fire. That's just fire, bro. But yeah, we're gonna move on to a little bit of some sadder, sadder news. This shit's really bugging me. <laughs> let it go, fam. Okay, okay, okay. Let we'll it go. See. But it wasn't status. <laughs> it was something else. Okay. Okay, maybe it was. I don't know. I don't think it was. But I'll look it up. I'll look it up later, and I'll talk about it in the next part. Yeah. <laughs> it's like so. I'm gonna do like an edit, <laughs> like while I'm editing it. Like, oh and my. it was called. <laughs> Back to the red gun. <laughs> nah, it's cool. uh, whatever. Shit. But yeah, so on to some uh, Saturn news. Mm-hmm. So I don't know if you guys have been listening. You want to take this one? I feel like I've been talking for a lot, man. My no, jaws, no, no. You go, my you jaws go, hurt. You, you go. You're on a roll. Ah, oh, shit. That's it's okay. Good. That's because yeah, because I was looking this shit up for a while. All right, all right, you go. So on go some Saturn news. Mm-hmm. Um. I don't know if everyone's been listening to the news lately or following it. For when I first saw this, it popped up on my YouTube. Mm-hmm. So I was like, oh shit, Like, let me just check this out. And I'm a huge fan of like true crime stuff and all this shit. So I was like, yeah, what the fuck is going on, right? Yeah. So when I when I first... Um, oh, is this about the YouTuber? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh shit. When okay. I first um, heard the story, they just said that she was missing. Yeah. And at that time, she was missing for about like a week. Okay. All right. So this, if, if you don't know, this is a story about Gabby Petito. Um, so pretty much her and her boyfriend went on a road trip. Mm-hmm. Uh, they were seen by some witnesses for where the witness said that the girl was actually hitting the dude and yeah. doing all this shit. And, um, you know, I just, I guess at that time, their relationship might have been a little toxic. Did you watch that clip? I didn't watch the clip. I watched the clip for when, like, when I saw the clip, it was a clip for when the police got there. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. The with, the, were... with the body cam. Yeah, yeah, yeah with the here. body cam and shit. Yeah, so that I shit get... was tricky. So this, I, I ended up watching that shit after I found out yeah. that she had passed away. And then it was like, I was looking it up on YouTube and shit, and it said, like, the last time they saw her or whatever mm-hmm. kind of thing, right? The body cam, the police... Yeah, so I watched it. It was trippy, man, watching that shit. Because she was like, when they first went up to her, she was like in tears and shit. Mm-hmm. And then she was kind of like, she was like kind of defending him at mm-hmm. first. Like, oh, it's my fault yeah. and like whatever. And like, I was I was being mean to him and shit like that. And I was like, what the fuck? And like, he was like super calm. Yeah. Shit. Well, that's know. a possibility. She she, right? she might have been. You know yeah, I mean? yeah. No, no, for sure. Yeah. For sure. But like, because she was saying like, that's why they swerved and shit. Because he, he, he said that she like grabbed the wheel. Yeah. And then they asked her, she grabbed the wheel, and she's like, nah. <laughs> she's like, I'm gonna kill y'all, so 
<laughs> yeah, but then she said she didn't even grab the wheel. Oh shit! And I was like, what the? F-? I was like, wait a minute. So is he is he lying or yeah. was she just like maybe she like just didn't want to say it, yeah, but she was yeah. scared to say that she grabbed the wheel or something? I don't know what happened, but yeah, they they took her out of the the car first and put her in the back seat of the police car. And just, like, asked her a bunch of questions. They were, like, super calm and shit. And she just seemed, like, kind of like a wreck. Mm. But she was also, like, not trying to shit on him. Like, she was trying yeah, to defend yeah. him and stuff like yeah. that. And even he was, like, trying not to, like, throw under the bus, yeah, too, yeah. right? He was kind of, like, holding back and stuff. It was, like, super weird. Like, he seemed, like, just, like, a chill, calm guy. Even the, the police were, like, getting along with him yeah. and shit. Like, they didn't... They weren't aggressive at all. Yeah. You know, they were, like, super polite to him. And they were even, like, joking around with him at one point. He was, like, dabbing them up and shit at the end of it, like, when they let him go. He's like, all right, man. Yeah, yeah no, pretty much. I think they, like, shook hands. And he, like, he's like, oh, yeah, I was good to meet you, blah, blah. Yeah. Because after they were going to press charges on her. Her, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, like, beating him up yeah. or whatever, right? Like, abuse and shit. And he was, like, trying to figure out a way where they, like didn't press charges yeah. or the way yeah. that they could see her or whatever so they had to separate for the evening and then like go link up the next day or something but they weren't allowed to talk or mm. text or anything they 100% texted that day oh for sure <laughs> even though they were like told not to but like yeah yeah so that, it was probably pretty... even saw her <laughs> yeah oh like... for sure right, right so like yeah it's pretty sad that like and knowing that she had passed away and then watching that yeah it's like damn you you wish you could go back and you wish the police would have done yeah a little bit more Maybe it would have been better if they did take her to jail yeah. for the night or something, you know, like just to get her away from that situation or like, I don't know, called someone in her family or something to come get her or like, I don't know, so something, anything than just letting them go. But like, I don't know, you, you, you say that already knowing what happened, mm. right? If you didn't, if none of that happened, yeah. then would you think to go back or yeah. like, would it just seem like a regular... So that's tough. It's a tough situation. It's super sad, for sure. They were, like, documenting their, like... I think it was, like, a cross-country in the van type yeah, shit, yeah. whatever, right? And just, like, filming wherever they went and their experiences. And all this. It's a cool concept and shit, but, like... It's weird now watching... Because there's, like... There's, I think there's just, like, one video. Yeah. Well, I only saw one video on her channel oh, okay. about that. And it's just them just, like, having a good time. They're, like, camping and shit. It's just, like, a regular vlog. Like, I yeah. wouldn't think twice about it. yeah. And it's so weird. It's like, fuck, this guy actually, like, killed her. Like, that's fuck. And now he's like, as far well, as I know. The thing is, it's not proven. It hasn't been proven. I mean, he, yeah. But allegedly. But okay. it's leaning. It's a 95, 5%. Yeah. Like, 95% chance that, because, bro, it doesn't look good for him at all. Yeah. And he's on the run, too. Yeah. That, like. That's the thing. Do you think. I don't want to speculate. No, that's that's the reason why we're doing this shit. We're speculating. Yeah. Well, do you think, like, something happened, like, she had an episode again and, like, attacked him, and then she he, like, was a little bit rough and, like, maybe she fell or something and, like, it was an accident, and now he's like, oh, fuck, they're gonna blame me for this shit? But the thing and now is, he's, like, on the run? The thing is, though, bro, like, even... Okay, so... And I'm not trying to defend him. Yeah, I'm just yeah, saying, yeah. like... No, 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 no. I don't know what happened. Like, the thing but, is, even with that... Yeah. If, 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 if it's an accident... Say it's an accident. Yeah. And stick around. But people do that shit. Hit and runs happen all the time. You, you hit a car. It's like, our oh, boy fuck, just fuck went, Our boy just, just went... Our, literally, our boy just went through that shit. Yeah, no one's sick because they know they're going to get in trouble. So they just fucking like... But bro, yeah. take it on the chin, man. Be a man. Yeah. At the end of the day, if you didn't mean to and it wasn't intentional, mm-hmm. explain what the fuck happened. Yeah. You know what I mean? But you going on the run and hiding out... Makes it worse. And his parents are now like not saying anything. They're like... They're his parents have his back pretty much yeah. so and it's not like they don't know that this nigga is gone cause they he went to their house and then after that he dipped he had his camping gear all this shit and yeah. he dipped so it's oh, like shit. bro now helicopters have been flying around looking for the homeboy all this shit like yeah, you know what I mean mm-hmm. like Oh man. Yeah. That's like crazy. but I also understand the justice system because it's like also too the justice system is fucked up. And mm-hmm. there's been many times where people haven't done shit or it's something's have been an accident, but instead of getting manslaughter, a nigga gets life or he gets a death penalty, some shit like that. When you know, when, when it's not even meant to be like that. In court it's just like a who proved their argument better. And if you win, yeah. you win. It's not That's they don't, what it is. And it's yeah. ass. Yeah. That is so ass because yeah. it's like Bro, yeah. sometimes you just got to look at the facts and look at what the fuck happened. 
Yeah. I'm so I, I feel so sad for this girl's family and for her too because obviously like you go on a trip with your significant other you don't and, and like obviously people get into arguments sometimes man like you go on a trip with your girl sometimes y'all get into an argument on a trip like you know yeah. or you go whatever but bro yeah. you don't expect that this is gonna be the last time no not at all that doesn't even cross your you fucking, know yeah that's fucked it's such a sad situation, dude. Such a sad situation, man. Yeah. Such a sad situation. Still, girl still had her whole life ahead of her. The dude still has his whole life ahead of him. And now that's two lives lost. And that's mm-hmm. two families whose lives are fucked up forever. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's fucked up, man. And, like, she obviously was, like, suffering with, like... I don't know, she had, like, anxiety or yeah. some shit like that, right? So, yeah. like... I don't know, man. It's just a super sad situation it sucks that like it got to that point like who knows what the fuck happened or what drove it to that point but the yeah. fact is it got there yeah. somehow yeah and it sucks that like that was the result yeah. of whatever happened you know like it's always tough to hear stories like that man, yeah, man. but the world is fucked man yeah bro don't understand I, the shit man i just don't understand like Man. Where's this guy gonna run? He's right? gonna get caught eventually. Like, where are you going? Like, you're gonna have to show up. You can't live your whole life like this. They're aren't gonna they, find you. Aren't you're... they in LA? So, like, where are you gonna run to? Like, the <laughs> desert, nigga? Yeah. Like, you know, they're he... gonna find him. As yeah. soon as he fucking buy something and uses his credit card or some shit like that like he's gotta he's gotta go somewhere you gotta get a house you gotta stay somewhere and, you if, gotta... Not, and if I if we're in Canada and we yeah. know yeah. this shit you don't think the mm-hmm. rest of these motherfuckers know? Oh. Bruh. Yeah, camera's gonna find you eventually. And your fucking name recognition thing's gonna show up. They're gonna flag you down. They're gonna find you. I bet you he don't got a Vax card. I... <laughs> he can't get in. Nah. He can't get in nowhere, bro. Nah, man. He can't, he can't scan his, his ID door. He can't charge his phone. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah. No, he can't do anything. Yeah, he can't turn his phone on. He can't li- do any of that shit. Like a... Yo, the only place he can go to. <laughs> this guy turns into Jason Bourne, gets nah. like burner phones and shit, <laughs> just turns into a fucking assassin. Yeah, what are those people that don't believe in like electronics and technology? Mormons or whatever the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so. like, he has to go into a Mormon community. Those are the only motherfuckers that don't know what the fuck he did, like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, he Becomes, damn. like, a monk. <laughs> so she just turns Buddhist. <laughs> just, like... <laughs> <laughs> damn, bro. That's fucked, That's up. so fucked, man. I'm just, like... Man, it's just so sad how, like, shit like that... Shit like that happens in this world, bro. Like, mm-hmm. man, if you're not feeling somebody and, like... They're pissing you the fuck off, and, like, you feel like you're, like, what you gotta do is kill them. Nigga, just leave. Just leave. Bro. Like, just get out of there. Like, like fuck, yeah. break up. It's, it's like, over. Rap. Fuck it. That's all you gotta do. Yeah. Just, just leave. How hard it's, is that shit? There's you'll no cry. She'll cry. Yeah. But fuck that's it. That's it. That's, bro, the, like, worst, that's, that's it. the worst thing that I've like, yo. Oh, you cry a little bit? Like, fuck, <laughs> like, oh, no. Like, <laughs> shit. God damn, cry, motherfucker. <laughs> God damn it. Right? Like, what? Yeah. What the fuck? It's not that bad, man. Just, <laughs> just get out of there. Like, yo, people are so people are just so fucked up. It's so fucked up. Like that's the thing, man. Like, how do you even get to that point as like a human <laughs> to be like, nah, I'm gonna kill this person. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna take that life. Like, oh, I couldn't do it. That's fucked. Yeah. Man. Fuck. I accidentally hit, hit a fucking cat with my car and my heart broke. Yeah. Bro, I was driving down fucking... I was driving down the street. <laughs> and it was nighttime. And this cat just ran across the street. And I was going probably like 90, bro. Damn. I hit the fuck out of this cat. I hit the fuck out of this cat. Shit. Like, oh, man. And it makes me so sad because I have a cat. Yeah, I was gonna so say. So I went home. Your cat just looking at me. Yeah. Like, I know, I like, know what you did. <laughs> You oh, bastard. Yeah, right? Am I next? Am I next? <laughs> Still to this day, bro. He was looking Still, at the cat. I just look at, judging you. I know. I know, bro. And it was in my van, like my work van. Oh, I, my God. Uh, Roadkill. Seriously. Shit. I had a homie that drove past that same site. He's like, yo, I saw the cat. Like, I was like, oh. <laughs> I thought I was like I heard they had nine lives. <laughs> Please he look like that. popped up. <laughs> He's like damn it. He's like that was life time not again. <laughs> Third time tonight. <laughs> I can better get off the street. <laughs> Crip, Crip walks away. Crip walks away. Oh my god. <laughs> I got six more. 
<laughs> Fuck, man. That's fucked. But yeah. That sucks. Rest in peace, Gabby Petito. And I hope you find that motherfucker. <laughs> Seriously. Find him. And yeah. question the fuck out of him. And yeah. figure it out. What yeah. the, the fuck happened. You found yes. these two chicks that robbed the guy. Yeah. Find, find this dude. Find what this the fuck? Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh, oh, you found man. the guy that took the Rolex, but this guy committed murder. You can't find him. What the fuck? What are you doing? Uh, they put out helicopters and work. everything. You still can't find this motherfucker, bro? Oh, my God. Do they use helicopters? Helicopters, bro. This guy's hiding in a tree somewhere. I bet he is. In a bush. Just chilling. <laughs> eating Doritos. If I'm walking in the forest and I see a white nigga in a tree, I'm beating his ass I'm up, like, oh, I'm, like, I'm throwing rocks. This guy did something. I'm throwing rocks This guy like... did something. <laughs> Is hiding in a bush <laughs> 3 like, o'clock in the afternoon like, Yo, nigga, what the, the fuck, fuck are you doing I'm back in the way I'm calling the police immediately <laughs> hey uh are you looking for a 24 year old <laughs> <Right>? male <laughs> he's like hey can I use your phone he's yeah. like no wearing blue jeans <laughs> right? and a white t-shirt <laughs> He's in the bush, like, 20 feet from me. Does this guy do something? He looks kind of musty. Yeah. Dude's just uh, hanging out in a bush. Right? <laughs> like, are y'all looking for nobody? Right? Y'all looking for something? Come on. Oh, man. Because right. I found him. <laughs> yeah, that's fucked. No one's just uh, sitting in a bush. Yeah, bro. Oh, man. But, yeah. Speaking of some more fucked up shit that happened. So, mm-hmm. I have a theory. On Instagram, I've been seeing some shit. And it's kind of, like, pissing me off, but it's making me laugh at the same time. So, I call this fake donations, okay? Oh, <laughs> this shit. is the reason why I call this fake donations. I've been seeing Instagram uh, pages okay. post pictures of girls, right? Girls in bikinis, in suggestive <clears throat> positions, shit like that. Okay. Because, obviously, that attracts people to that. Of course, yeah. All right? So, people are looking at that shit, and... <laughs> There's a link and it says donate, uh-huh. right? So I was like, "Oh, what's this new shit on Instagram? Let me just click and see." I click it, and the title of the donation was <laughs> uh, "Send funds to help clean up the ocean." Right? Mm-hmm. Now their goal, their target goal was one hundred and twenty-five dollars <laughs> <laughs> to clean the ocean. <laughs> to clean the ocean. But you can't even clean your bathtub, runner. <laughs> what the fuck you do the ocean, bro? You know how big the ocean right? is, right? I was like... It's bigger than $125. $125? Nigga, yeah. you need people to donate to give you $125? But what like, are you doing with the $125? Right? Can't even rent a boat. How are you going to get out there? How are you going to get to the ocean? Exactly. What the fuck? Exactly. Man? Like, you know, I just think people are using this shit. Fake... That's what I call fake donations. They want people to donate. They'll put a pretty girl on the fucking front to make you feel like you're donating to her when you're not. Yeah. Probably donating to a nigga that looks like FaZe. <laughs> $125 and he's out here buying chicken and shit listen <laughs> you think this podcast runs itself it costs money it costs about $125 a week to run this shit <laughs> he wants to save the ocean <laughs> uh, project save the ocean bro <laughs> stupid <laughs> oh, oh man this whole thing is stupid but like, I've been seeing a lot of this shit on IG so yeah. if you see that shit do your research if you're a fuck ass one that wants to donate mm-hmm. make sure you're donating to the yeah. right cause you never know you might be donating to those two Latino <laughs> girls that stole the Rolex <laughs> keep it up four, <laughs> under like, four thousand nine hundred and ninety nine dollars like, right? yeah. need to pay for bail and shit <laughs> don't donate five thousand four thousand nine hundred ninety nine each person oh my good yeah. oh man but yeah that's cr- people do like random shit man so like I get a lot of these. I'm sure you do too. I see a lot. I'm sure a lot of people get this shit. I, Cause I saw some people like complaining about it too. I get mad fucking Facebook invites by like these fucking models or girls and shit. Right. Lots, yeah. But they're all fake accounts. They're all like, like you click on one. It's like, I have a new WhatsApp group for blah, blah, blah. And it's like, oh, what? <laughs> Ever heard of crypto? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. What the fuck? <laughs> Your dick's out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> but it's funny it'll be like uh, you know it'll be like this fucking blonde white girl yeah. owner, right? and the name will be like Jesus Valejandro <laughs> like that. Like, I'll be like what the fuck <laughs> tuck your dick back in yeah <laughs> or like no so, Jesus sometimes, sometimes, sometimes they fuck up and it's like three pictures of like the hot girl yeah. and then this one like like Filipino 18 year old is like at the bottom it's like wait a minute <laughs> this used to be my old account I converted it <laughs> 
It's like, like the name's like Jessica. Uh, <laughs> like, what the fuck? Oh god, yo, these fuckers ain't slick, bro. These niggas ain't yeah, slick, bro. It's, <laughs> I get uh, so many of yo, them. I though. Guess, me too. It's like what the me fuck? Too, How many too. of them are there? And why do you, I don't follow any of you? So right. like, why do I keep getting them? Exactly. I keep I hitting fucking decline. How many times can I hit decline? Facebook, stop just sending let, me this I shit. just let it stack up. I probably have like over like all these years I stopped using Facebook. Yeah. I probably have over like four hundred of those. Yeah. Just probably. chilling there waiting for me to. <laughs> Just get like five, ten a day. Right. <laughs> Just like sitting there. Like one it's day like, he's gonna nah. accept it. And then we got him. <laughs> what the fuck? That uh, shit's crazy. That's man. nuts, bro. Yeah. I don't know why the fuck they keep doing that shit, but <laughs> trust me. Guys, if you see a hot blonde named Jesus <laughs> trying to follow you, yeah. it's not it's not it's not her. <laughs> <laughs> oh man imagine being at the club and his chick comes up to you <laughs> she's like oh damn she's fine she's like what's your name <laughs> hey Zeus like what the fuck oh shit I know you <laughs> you sent me a Facebook hey, she's like yeah you didn't follow me back <laughs> <laughs> damn it <laughs> oh shit <laughs> oh shit oh man <laughs> oh fuck well I some music bro so Meek yeah. Mill, your boy, my boy Meek Mill, <laughs> your boy. It's been a while. We haven't Yo. talked about Meek in a while. Okay, I ain't no Meek Mill hater. I just want to beat his ass. <laughs> I just want to beat his ass, bro. Like seriously, I'm not a hater. This album, fire, <laughs> fire. Yo, fire. This guy talks shit about Meek Mill for the first eight fire. episodes. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> took a little break. I was like, listen, man. I ain't a hater. <laughs> I'm gonna give a nigga his props when he does some good shit. I ain't no hater, bro. Okay. But this shit is fire. All right. This shit is fire. This shit is so fucking fire. Yeah? Yeah, bro. Let's, right, cool, let's, cool. let's start it off. Just, I, I, Are you going to play some shit? Oh, I got to. Okay, okay. Let's not play like nine minutes of shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> let's no, no. keep it at like 20 seconds, uh, 30 seconds. This, this shit right here, bro. This is some shit hey, when you're working this out. This shit right here? This shit right here? This shit right here? Yeah. Oh, fucking all about this, bro. This is a famous beat. Who's beat this? I don't know. I don't know this beat. Fuck. But Meat Mill no killed this shit. I beat Meat Mill. I, I will beat Meat Mill's no ass to this track. This His like, own shit. <laughs> yeah, this is a hype this one. Right? That's what I'm saying, bro. That beat is like hella familiar though. I think that's a pretty famous this beat. Or at least similar. Like, it's uh, very similar because I know that beat. I like this. I like this. I like this Isn't better that, than Champions. You can hate me now. No, but we won't okay. stop now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nah, 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 it's nah. Nas. <laughs> it's Nas beat. Wait a minute. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's, let's... What? Are you sure? It sounds similar, but... Unless they flipped it. That's how I get back in the streets. Because I feel like they might have flipped it. Yeah, 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 I'm not, I'm not even gonna play. No, no, no! You got it. You got it. I'm not even gonna play it. You got when, to. No, no! I'm not even gonna play beforehand because yeah. I already know it's this beat. Escobar season has Come on, come on. Yeah, <laughs> immediately. They even, took immediately. The, they even took the intro. Immediately. <laughs> yeah, everything. <laughs> immediately. Wait, why would he use a Nas track though? They he even took the he, intro. He, he the hope? Like, no turning back now. <laughs> This yeah, I might like me just a little bit more. This is what I am, baby. <laughs> this guy's fighting Nas. And thought we wouldn't notice you. Hate me, nigga! <laughs> you gonna bite Nas and think we wouldn't notice? You think we wouldn't notice that shit? Come on. Oh, shit, bro. You think, you think they remember this? You think they forgot? No, we didn't forget Nas. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the fuck? Oh, shit. Meek Mill thinks he's slick. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, but see, Nas beats. <laughs> One of the most famous Nas beats ever. <laughs> you can hate me now. Yeah, bro. No, yeah. Bro, this shit is fire. Next thing you know, he's like, if I ruled the world, I'm gonna get your ass out of here. <laughs> <laughs> this guy just listened to the Nas album and hit the studio. <laughs> he's like, yo, Diddy, let me get that beat real quick. 
<laughs> fuck out of here. I want you yeah. to, now I want you to beat up Big Bill. Yeah. <laughs> Those are taking that beat. I'm gonna beat his ass. No, Don't but it, it is like his fuck. Yeah, sure. it, trust me, this album is fire. He has a lot of sick features on here. He got um Lil Baby, Lil Dirk, he got Kehlani, ASAP Ferg, Moneybag Yo, Giggs, he got Young Thug, he got Holy Bory, shit. Lil Uzi, Lil Snoop. Oh, <laughs> it's like a collab album. Oh, no, he ain't got no Lil Snoop. It's called RP Lil Snoop. But he got Brent Fayaz. But for us, bro, this shit is good. But he has some some single joints in here. But I'll, I listened to the whole shit. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, bro, it's All good. Right. It's good. I like it better than Champions. Um, okay. I'm I'm gonna give it a little bit more of a of a listen of a little bit more of a deep dive. Yeah. Run it back a couple times and okay. then. But so far, the first listen. Yeah. Proper. Yeah. Proper. Okay. Proper. I haven't heard it yet, so I'll I'll, I'll download it. Yeah. I'll check sure. it out. That's dope. For sure. That's just so funny. For <laughs> sure. The first song he plays me. I'm like, why is it be so familiar? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know this right? beat. <laughs> like, 100% Yo, sure I know man. this beat. But he killed that shit. Like, yeah. The, I, no, it sounded good with him on it. Yeah. Yeah, the remix. Joe Button podcast. Remix. These niggas was like, these niggas was like, oh, man, I don't like it. I don't, like, I don't really like it. But it was like, it was kind of half and half. But I was like, Yo, I like it. I like it. Wait. You, so, wait. Joe Button podcast, they reviewed this shit? Yeah. But that song? Yeah. <laughs> and you watched it? I listened to it. <laughs> they didn't mention Nas at all? No. <laughs> right? <laughs> the fuck? Shit. Joe, what are you doing? Say shit about Nas. <laughs> Nas, look at how they do you, bro. That's the first thing I look said. Look at how they do you in your own state, bro. Joey, come what on, are you doing? Bro. Nas, nah, come to Vancouver. Let us take Maybe it. he didn't say it because it's like obvious. He's <laughs> yeah. like, everybody knows it's Nas. Like, I mean, I, it's so obvious, I don't even have to mention it. We'll give Joey props. Oh, All right, shit. cool, fine. We'll let him slide without one. Oh, man. All right. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> good album, good album. Oh, by the way, guess who's going to the Migos concert? <laughs> us. <laughs> <laughs> we going to the Migos concert. It's going to be live. Let's go. <laughs> it's going to be live. It's going to be live, man. Got my ticket already. You got our ticket already? <laughs> yeah, we'll cut it in half. And <laughs> we'll both sit outside. We'll both sit outside. <laughs> I'll sneak face. The under fuck? My, under my shirt. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? I done cop the ticket. I got it as a surprise. I didn't get it myself. Who got it for you? People's. Well, tell your Next. people I'm pissed. <laughs> <laughs> you can get your red cup, <laughs> Reverend Year of Year. Come people on. love me, bro. <laughs> okay. Fine. I didn't even buy this shirt. Somebody sent me this in the mail, bro. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I bought this look shirt. At you. Look, at, look, how, look how quick you want to lie. <laughs> this guy's been 45 minutes in the store. Should I, should I buy it? Yeah, right. <laughs> I was like, yo, y'all got my size. <laughs> oh, man. But yo, like... When is it? Huh? When is it? Oh, okay. So it was supposed to be last week. So I was going to come on here <laughs> and I was going to tell y'all motherfuckers. It was supposed to be last week. It was supposed week. to be last week, bro. But these motherfuckers what canceled happened? or some shit. So it got moved to April. April? April. April 20th or April 22nd oh, or some fuck. shit like that. Oh, so we got mad time. Mad motherfucking time. Oh, I thought it was like next week. No, or no, 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 no. Because I knew it was around this time. No. It was supposed to be last week. Yeah. And then, and then in May, I'm going to Lovers and Friends Fest in Vegas. So that's going to be fun. In May? Yeah. Already got my tickets for that shit, too, so. I might be going to Vegas in January. Oh, shit. Let's see how it goes. Oh, shit. brother laws birthday. Oh, that's what's up. That's I'm trying to go up. see the Raiders play, too. Because his favorite team is the Chargers. Oh. And they play each other the first ah, week. So. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yes, tickets are like 500 bucks each. <laughs> oh, fuck. Are they uh, Division One Rivalry? Yeah. Oh, that's why. I said yeah. That. yeah, that's why. Yeah, I said that. yeah. They're playing this Monday too. Oh damn. Yeah. So they play twice this year. So oh, they play this shit. Monday and then they play the last game of the season. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's what's up. Yo, Vegas is gonna be lit, bro. Oh yeah. Just bring a lot of money with you, cause I, when I went to Vegas, bro, oh, yeah, I got a drink. One yeah. drink was fifty bucks. One. One, <laughs> nigga. What? I went to DJ Mustard. Okay, DJ Mustard had a First of all, party. I've been to Vegas a bunch of times, so I know how much is drinks. About fifty bucks for a drink. Fifty bucks for a drink. What I did was- you order? I don't know. That was a bottle. That was no, no, no. It, it, was, it, it, it wasn't like no henny or nothing. It was like lemonade something mixed with some other shit. It wasn't anything was crazy. Was it one of those like big ones? No, and had bro. A literally. Curly straw on shit. It was this high. You see where my finger is right here? I, I that was the you. top of the drink. I hate to tell you, but someone ripped you off. Bro. <laughs> 50 t- bucks? And I got three drinks. Also, all three were 50 bucks? No. One was 50 bucks. One was 50 bucks. So you spent 150 bucks on three drinks? Three, nigga. Who'd you go to Vegas with? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> my girl they, he, and her friend. Okay, listen. <laughs> Once you came back the first time with a fifty dollars drink, I would have been like, "Don't Bro, go back there." 
I didn't go back. We just had that one drink. But you had three of them. Yeah, because it was from oh, all three of us. <laughs> you ordered three at the yeah, same time. Yeah, spent... So this guy went to the bar, ordered three drinks, and the guy's like, 150 bucks. Girl was like hundred fifty bucks. And okay, I can't so, say nothing because so, she, she gonna scream. So twenty of that <laughs> she, she twenty scream. of that went to the bar. Yeah. And 130 went in her pocket. No, no, no. Yeah. hundred yeah, percent. There ain't no fifty dollar drinks. I was like, no, a bro. Drink. But then I went to the strip club, a, a shot of henny, fifty bucks. Nigga, a shot. Smaller than that, bitch, bro. Yeah, but shots are Okay. No, but yeah. it's a shot. Fifty is a lot for 50 a shot. Fifty is a fucking lot, bro. Yeah, yeah. Fifty yeah. is a lot. Yo, my Vegas trip was nice, but it was fucked up at the same time. These strippers tried to finesse me, and then they tried to fuck yeah, after. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where you're having fifty dollars. Like, yeah. Where? Why is? Why is fifty dollars shots? Fifty dollars drinks? Bro, I don't know why everything is fifty dollars. That's, that's a different. No, it's not. It's not though. Everything's fifty dollars. It's in not. Vegas. You're going to the wrong places. Yo, okay. So I went to DJ Mustard's after uh, pool party, right? Okay. It was lit. That's it, was, it. it was at Dre's in Vegas, so. Nice. Went up there and I'm rolling with two shorties, right? So you know when you roll with two shorties in Vegas, everyone thinks you're the man. Yeah. So it's like, all right, cool. So we got we got so much shit. We got a twelve hundred dollar cabana, free drinks for free. The cabana was free. The drinks were free. <laughs> Bro, everything. Cause this nigga wanted to fuck one of the shorties that I was rolling with. Yeah. So <laughs> so then yeah. the, like, 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 hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> it's like, listen, you gonna fuck for but, this cabana? But, drink, but drinks are free. <laughs> You going to and the drinks are refillable, my nigga. Like <laughs> bottomless drinks, my nigga. Drinks with no bottom. They just kept coming, bro. Like, <laughs> like it was nuts. It was nuts. And like, and then where were you having fifty dollars drinks? Bro, I drank all fucking day, all fucking day. I had a daiquiri thing that I was just holding, walking around with. Yeah, yeah, I that was. Oh, yeah, oh my god, yeah. that was beautiful. And yeah. then on top of that, as soon as we get to that cabana, bro, I was just drinking all. Fucking thing never stop. Woke up, drank again for breakfast. I <laughs> just kept going, bro. That's it was sick. beautiful. Yeah. It was beautiful. But anyways, went to the party. Yeah. It was lit. Uh, drinks were expensive as fuck. <clears throat> Girls were turking everywhere. It was beautiful. And I ran into an NBA player, uh, Victor Oladipo. We dapped up, said what's up. And my uh, trip was made, <laughs> pretty much. After go. that, I was like, yo, nobody talk to me on the shit. <laughs> like, fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm famous, bitch. I thought, you t- I thought you were gonna tell us where you got these fifty dollars drinks from. Oh, we got it from the from uh the pool party. DJ Mustard's pool party. Oh, yeah. where, where was the cabana? The cabana was at a separate hotel. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So this is like the this... pool. But I've been to pool parties and the drinks are fifty bucks. But you ain't been to DJ Mustard's pool party. Okay. <laughs> when DJ Mustard was like at the top yeah. of the game. <laughs> I think I think we had like Lil John or something at ours. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. yeah Yo, yeah. funny thing is we got two tickets for Tory Lanes and we never went. Oh, really? <laughs> I didn't even know Lil John was gonna be there. Oh, like, really? We just went and he was there. <laughs> Some shit. I was like, oh, okay, cool. I was like, all right. Oh, damn. That's yeah. lit. Yeah, that's, that's lit. Yeah, Vegas is And just showing up and like Lil John's DJ. He's like, oh, shit. <laughs> that's crazy. Oh, what's up, bro? Yeah. <laughs> Dap him up. Yo, you just gotta. The thing I love about Vegas, you just yeah. gotta act like. Yeah. You, you've been there. Like, you know somebody. Yeah. And people are always like. No, 100%. Like, yo, you know what's. Nah, nigga, I'm just. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah like, you know, nah, for sure. I, no, it's, de- it's definitely a different ship when you have I'm connections there, for sure. <laughs> I'm that guy. Can't talk to all the people for eight seconds. Can't talk to me, nigga. Now he's like, you can't even talk I'm to me. I'm like that. Can't I'm even, like Can't that. even take this guy nowhere. <laughs> We're not talking about talking to all the people. Go to Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> you want to charge me? <laughs> you know who I am? I'm the nigga that dapped that Victor all the people. Every time he makes a shot, he's like, I touched his hand. <laughs> Victor! <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> oh my oh, god, bro! Shit. That shit was that, that shit was cool. Dope. Yeah, that was dope. That shit was dope. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, man, it was, Vegas was awesome. So if if you guys ever want to go, man, go. And if you in Canada, so what's in where you went in May for for what? Lovers and Friends Fest. Oh, okay, cool. So Usher's gonna be there. Lil John's gonna be there. <laughs> Lil John stays in Vegas. Yeah. I'm pretty sure he has a residency in probably, Vegas. Probably. I'm pretty probably. sure. Yeah. Usher, Usher has one too right now. So. Oh, does he? Yeah. His, oh, okay, cool. The second leg of his resi- uh, residency is gonna begin pretty soon. Yeah. So it's good that he's gonna be on that festival stage. Okay, cool. Yeah. So this dude's just making money out there. Oh, for sure. Making Usher bucks. <laughs> Usher. <laughs> <laughs> but no, shit. That's sick though. That yeah, man. Dope. Super sick. How long are you going for? <sighs> It's like three, four days. That's a good time. Yeah, yeah three, four days. I think like, three days is good. Yeah, in Vegas. Yeah, four max. Yeah, Otherwise, four max. Like, you can't. Other, no, no it's too much. Nah, man. People nah. go for a week. I'm like, how? How? We go hard in Vegas. Like we Bro, don't sleep. We don't sleep. So, nothing. Like, I ain't trying to go for a week. Just sleep sleeping, now. fucking, 
eating, drinking. Nah, nah. Three, three is perfect. Four yeah. at the end. You gotta leave like on that fourth yeah. day or some shit like exactly. that. You know, it's like. Fuck. Or that fourth day, you just don't party. You just like. I yeah, remember when I get some when, food, just chill. You know. The, the last, <laughs> the last day, we went to the fucking movies. We're like, yo, let's just go yeah. chill. Yeah, fuck. Oh man. I usually go watch the fucking um. What's that? Cirque du Soleil. Oh, nice. Go watch that shit. Nice. Oh, like a chill. Go somewhere nice to like, eat for dinner and yeah. shit like that. Just have a chill day. Okay. Yeah, because the other days you just go fucking go ham. Oh, shit. Yeah. Fuck, bro. Full Fuck. parties, evening parties. Yeah. Do a little shopping. Yeah. Yeah, man. Fuck, man. That's good. I want to run into fucking Mayweather, bro. That's that's the one nigga I need to run into when I'm in Vegas because he's just always to, out there. Just go to girls. <laughs> Girls collection? Yeah. 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 Go there, go to his gym, be like, yo, I just want to box with a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right? Javante. <laughs> yeah. I'm sparring with Javante. Oh, my God. <laughs> That'd be cool just to stop by, because there's always people there. Imagine if I spar with Javante and I knock his ass out. I get that. I get that puncher's chance. <laughs> yeah. And then knock his ass out. Oh, my God. I would immediately just leave the gym. Yeah. I would just be like... I don't think you have a choice. <laughs> M- Mr. Davis, I'm so sorry. Nah, I don't think you'll get that far. I think I put, gotta, my, put my gloves down. You just gotta get your bag and run. <laughs> like, like, yo, no. guys, uh, my Uber's here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this guy flies over the top rope <laughs> in a full sprint. It's like, yo. It's gonna me too, I'm so sorry. I hit the golden boy. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. That's crazy. <laughs> Mr. Davis. <laughs> you just run out, you're running out the gym, like, running down the street, just laughing your ass. I'm like, I did it. I did it. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit that's nuts damn bro that'd be sick but I want I want <laughs> dap him up <laughs> no he's gonna knock you out <laughs> by accident <laughs> it's a girl <laughs> he's a girl oh, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't know how to dab he's just punches the, you see him by the club and you're like yo what's up he's like I remember you <laughs> oh shit soul just leaves <laughs> soul he just leaves my body <laughs> knocks, yeah. knocks my dreads off drop your $50 drink <laughs> it's on the floor <laughs> I still, I still catch it, but I'm still not. You're knocked out, but you catch it. Yeah. It's $50. <laughs> $50. Oh, man. I'll wake up, drink it. I'm good. Wake up, <laughs> wake up like the Undertaker. Just, just sit up. <laughs> Everyone's like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's like Tuesday now. It's like a, <laughs> crack my neck. All right, my turn. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Come here. <laughs> just go to bitch, town. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit <Jeez. laughs> I ain't letting Javante beat my ass fuck that I'm gonna go out dying I'm gonna die if I fight Javante yeah. I'm dying it's not gonna be but- a boxing match <laughs> you're gonna spear him and like you're gonna turn wrestling so quick <laughs> tables ladders and chairs you wanna hit him with this thing you with your mic Boom. stand <laughs> throw a Starbucks drink at his ass <laughs> fuck you bitch. everything bah, pumpkin spice <laughs> <laughs> oh shit oh, oh man <laughs> Shit, bro, that shit's nuts. That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. Vegas, man, I fucking love Vegas. I love Vegas. Like, yeah. <sighs> man, but... No, that festival will be good. Man. Yeah. Lots festival of good will music. be dope. Festival will be dope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, funny thing is, I haven't watched NFL so long that I don't know who the NFL players are. So if I just see, like, a Jack Black guy, I'm just like, oh, it's just another Jack <laughs> Black guy. Like, it's like the whole league. Yeah, it's like, oh, okay. Like, it's like, what do you do? Oh, I'm in the construction. Like, <laughs> it's like, yeah. You should play, you should play in the NFL. <laughs> it's like, I do. <laughs> oh, man. Fuck, oh, man. <laughs> oh, speaking of the NFL. Yeah. Like a pro. You see that shit? See like that a alley-oop? pro. That alley no, you don't even know. You I did. Even, no, don't you? I did. Okay. <laughs> I, did. <laughs> I did. I did. I did. I set you up. <laughs> See, my transition game so good. You thought I didn't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I knew. I was like, I can't believe you said that. <laughs> what are the odds? <laughs> the Super Bowl halftime yes, show was sir. just recently announced. And what a lineup we have. Okay, who we got? Who we got? Let's let's build our way up. It better be good because some of these actually I don't be... even know where to start because they're all fucking up here. <sighs> all right. We got Dr. Dre, mm. Snoop Dogg, Mary J. Blige, K. Dot himself, and the one, the only, Slim Shady. 
Eminem is gonna be in the building at the Super Bowl. And it's in LA. Listen, Dre, Snoop, and K Dot is enough. But Dre, Snoop, and K Dot in LA? With Mary J. Blige. Listen, Compton's just down the road, bro. <laughs> just, it's right there. It's just in the corner. It's right there, bro. What a fucking lineup, first of all. And just, yeah. just to have it in LA is, is crazy. Eminem, yo, that's my guy. Yeah. That's my guy. So the fact that he's going to be at the Super Bowl is just. It's crazy, man. It's Honestly, crazy. I could do without Eminem. Listen, man. You need to shut your mouth with that shit right now because Eminem is the GOAT. I don't care what you say. I don't care what anyone says. Eminem is the beast. And, so listen. <laughs> we don't need that one. We don't need that one. This, this ain't no clown shit. Say Eminem one more time. Listen. Nah. Eminem. No. Eminem. Listen, no. Eminem. <laughs> Listen, when it comes to lyricism, yes, there's no, there's no contest here. It's Slim, shady. Slim Shady. He's a beast. Okay. Yeah, man. How Slim? Come on. Is the shady. Just as slim as he is. <laughs> it's a moderate Slim. No, nah, man. <laughs> no, nah, I was surprised he. I was surprised he was uh, doing it because this guy doesn't really tour much or do shows like that. Yeah. So the fact that he's even gonna be there. And you know, he you gotta put him in there to fill the white demographic <laughs> for the Super Bowl. <laughs> you know what I mean? The white demographic. You can't as have you can't as have Dre and Snoop and K dot there. I mean, white people fuck with Snoop. Majority of white people fuck yeah, with Snoop. Yeah, okay, but you know just how yeah, we, because yeah. you gotta think of the NFL and it's like a lot of older fucking white people that know, and I'm so. sure, yeah, I know he fucks with like yeah. Martha Stewart and shit like that. I like but I mean people white... don't listen to hip hop and rap. I, honestly, and shit I feel like, like more people fuck more white people fuck with Snoop than they do with Eminem. I don't know about that. That's kind of tough. Uh, you maybe, think so? Maybe. I'm going to run a poll. I'm going to run a poll on Instagram. All right. Yeah, Y'all yeah. motherfuckers follow okay. that on the, okay. on the Red Cup boys. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> I wouldn't argue that fact too yeah. much. Yeah. Because, you know, especially with the Dre fucking yeah. signing off on M. M has a shitload of yeah. black fans too. Yeah. But, like, Eminem's music doesn't really relate to black people, yeah. which are understandable. makes sense. But Snoop's relate with everybody. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah, no, I, I understand that. And but the like, Martha Stewart thing helped. But if you're talking about like record sales and shit, oh, like, and yeah. blows them out of the fucking oh, water, sure, not sure. even close, like 100 times over. And another thing. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Peak Snoop versus Peak M. Well, what are we talking about? Though? <clears throat> Album sales. Oh, M, for sure. Not even close. Hmm? M's first album went fucking diamond. <laughs> How much did Snoop's do? Not Diamond. <laughs> Are you sure? Cause Snoop 100%. Because Snoop's was buzzing, bro. I don't think it went Diamond. I don't think Snoop has gone. I don't think Snoop has gone Diamond. Do you want me to fact check that? All right, yeah. I don't even know 100%, but I don't think, because that's a lot. I think Snoop's first album was Doggy Style, though. Yeah, which is fire, but I don't think it went Diamond. As much of a iconic album that is. I don't think it went Diamond. But that was a fire album, obviously. Fucking doggy style, man. And see, I grew up on, like, the West Coast shit. I yeah. grew up on Snoop and Dre. So, like, I'm psyched that they're performing. I'll fuck with both those guys. Obviously, like everyone else does. What are we fact-checking? If Snoop's doggy style went diamond? I don't think it did. It takes a lot to go diamond, man. I think M is only one of the only rappers that have gone diamond. This guy, this guy stood up like he sat, like he found some. Oh, I'm about to prove you wrong, Faze. I'd be surprised if it went diamond. Not that it's not a dope album, obviously. It's a fucking fire album. Double platinum. Double platinum, yeah. Not diamond. That's a long ways away from diamond. Yeah. Double <clears throat> platinum is two million. Yeah. Diamond, I think, is ten, 10 million. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Yeah. Eminem's nobody touches Eminem's record sales. Not even close. No. Shit. Drake is up there, obviously, but it's different now with Drake with but the streams and shit. Has like Drake that. gone but diamond like, though? He probably has. It different. It's different with the streams. Like streams for Drake, no one touches that. Yeah. Drake streams are out of the fucking world. Yeah. Right. But like, as far as cause this is Eminem's like albums. These aren't like online yeah, shit. Yeah, this yeah. is just physical copies. So that's like people went to the store, 
over 10 million times <laughs> to, to buy that shit. That's a lot. This is before streams, right? That's crazy. Yeah, so that's insane. Yeah, I'm telling you, M's a beast, man. No one touches that shit. Okay, and also the show is being put on by Rock Nation, too. Ooh. So Jay-Z organizing yeah, that shit. Yeah, he better. Which is another one of the goals. I'm glad he's part of the NFL, man. That shit well, for cool. sure, yeah. And Jay, and so that's why I'm kind of geeking out, because Jay and M are my, my top two. So that's crazy. The fact that they're involved in the same shit is Jay like, went from the dope. NBA to the NFL. Yeah. That's nuts. Yeah. Because he owns Rock Nation, right? He's so they probably, do a lot of concerts and shit He's probably kicking like the air right now that he still doesn't own part of the, the Nets. Because he owned but, the Nets when the Nets were ass. Yeah, but he can't because he... They, uh... They represent players now. Isn't that why he can't be a part of the owner? Ownership? He, he can't be part... He can't own a team and represent players that play for oh, different teams. Oh, right, 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 right. So right. I'm pretty sure he represents NBA players, NFL players, yeah. all that shit is under Rock Nation. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. Right? That's so true. he can't be... And you know what? He's probably is a part of that shit, but, like, someone else is there. Yeah. Just, like, they write the check to that guy yeah. who just, like, passes it over to Jay, yeah. right? Because, like, Jay not being involved in a Brooklyn basketball team makes no sense. Especially when he was, like, yeah. a minority owner. Yeah. But, like... He's definitely still, like, <laughs> low-key involved. Yeah. It's like, you be the face. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'll it's the like, money. Memphis Bleak is, like, <laughs> the owner. <laughs> Ain't no Bleaks around. Oh, my God. Bleak's just walking around the Brooklyn Nets fucking stadium and shit. What's up, guys? <laughs> you mean Kyrie having deep talks? Yeah, right. <laughs> He's like, yo, I don't know. I just feel like my girl's just not doing the same thing. <laughs> we just had a baby and, like... Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm to say? <laughs> I'm not getting the attention at all. Like, it's like, who are you? And <laughs> starts crying. This guy's always here. <laughs> Guy who's crying like five minutes before tip off. It's like, bro, <laughs> get your head in the game. <laughs> oh shit! But this Super Bowl's this Super Bowl is gonna be dope, gonna be man. Sick, it's gonna be yeah. sick. Yeah, this is one I'm actually like looking forward to. That's gonna be dope, man. Because they usually have like pop stars and yeah. shit, which is like cool, but yeah. it's not like. It's nice to have the hip hop yeah. element going in, like hardcore, like the actual yeah. Dre Snoop, like that's yeah. crazy, right? Mary, Mary's gonna be sick. The halftime show, yo, yeah. and it's that makes sense because like Drake to do that shit, yeah. Oh, he'll get his time for hundred yeah. percent. He'll do it. He'll probably do it next year or some shit. Yeah, yeah. No, but that's that's gonna be dope. And it's <laughs> the first thing I thought of because Snoop and M in the same show, but they squash their shit. Uh, their little one week <laughs> misunderstanding. Yeah. So that's cool. Yeah. Damn. That'll, okay. that'll be cool, man. Bro. Yeah. Side note, this is not this has nothing to do with halftime show. Huh. My eye does this weird shit. So like <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck are we Bro? <laughs> check this out. Check this out. Check this out. So <laughs> I knew you were you're like it's not about the Super Bowl. No, no, but this guy went way left. My field. eye does <laughs> some weird <laughs> shit. So, I don't know if there's anyone else in this world. What does your eye do? Okay, listen to this. Listen to this. You hear that shit? That like <laughs> Ew. Right? Ew. What are you, you doing? Hear that shit? What are you doing? Like, am I the only one? You're just rubbing your eye. I'm just rubbing my eye, but it makes that like like <laughs> Bro, sometimes when it's like... What? I can get it, and it's like... like are, you, are you just rubbing it? Like, yeah, bro. Like, I'm like, I don't know why it's so juicy. Like, All I do that. Let me... Nah, but I know... Nothing? Me. Yo, what the fuck? Right? Wait. <laughs> nah, nothing, nigga. Nothing, nothing. It ain't as juicy as mine. What the fuck? <laughs> What the fuck? I don't know why. You need a tissue? This <laughs> eye's leaking. This guy... Yo, my shit be doing some weird shit. Yo, I'm like, what, what the, the fuck? fuck? Yo, I need to figure this shit out, but it's cool. What the like, fuck? I guess I go to a party. That's my new way to break the ice. Yeah. I'm gonna just take the mic and be like, everybody. It's a remix. That's scratching. <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, <laughs> that's me. What's... This is a little bit of me. What the fuck? Me to you. He's got all this eye juice. <laughs> <laughs> Your eyes are drowning. Yo, <laughs> I got the juiciest eyes in the game. <laughs> His eyes stay watery. Yeah. It's like why are you eyes just like crying? <laughs> that's oh. crazy. What the fuck? <laughs> it's crazy. 
How did you figure that out? You're just rubbing your eye one bro, day, and you're like, what the fuck? I, that shit's been happening to me since, like, high school, bro. Like, I remember I was rubbing my eyes so hard, and one of my homies just turned around, and he's like, yo, I thought that was a chair. <laughs> keep it down. Like, <laughs> and keep it down over keep there. Keep it down What are you doing? Bro, hi. It's like, yeah, we're taking a test. <laughs> what a quiet. Holy fuck. <laughs> That's crazy. The uh, fact that he like heard it. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, bro. It was nuts. It was that's nuts. nuts. <laughs> Anyways, that's the Red Cup boys. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's going straight, <laughs> straight to the doctor's <laughs> office. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I'm gonna go get this shit checked out. Yeah, uh, I think that's a good place yeah. to end this shit. <laughs> Thanks for enjoying this episode. <laughs> Oh, shit. Thank you guys for joining us. Episode, what, 15? <laughs> yeah, 15. Let me queue up some shit. Red Cup Boys. Make sure you go on the YouTube channel and subscribe. Uh, yeah, check out the new music video. Check out the podcast, the older episodes. Check out Nightlife Confidential. All that shit. And uh, see you guys next week. Yes, we're going to leave you off with some uh, culture by Americano. I think this is a flip. It might be a flip of some Migos shit. I'm not sure. I've never heard this shit before, but I'm pretty sure y'all gonna like this shit because the music I listen to is pretty well. I'm not gonna lie. So, uh, here you go. <laughs> you never heard this before? Nope. What is <laughs> when I hear this, all I picture is me butt naked on a balcony of some Tim's and the wind blowing extra hard. And I'm just rubbing my eye. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful moment. <laughs> ah, Red Cup boys, we love you guys.